boy Junior Line finally That's made it here on the Drink Champs. Can't wait to get started with Boy Lori and everybody. Drink Champs, love y'all. Thank y'all for having me. Peace. What it could be, hopefully it's what it should be. This is your boy N O R E. What up is DJ E F N. And it's Middletainment Drink Champs ha Happy Hour. That's right. Make some noise. <laughs> now, now, when we started this show, we said we wanted to 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 give people, you know, their flowers. We wanted to give people the icons, the legends. When we talk about this man, this man has made countless music for 20, over 20, 25? Is it 25? 27. 27 years. Yeah. yeah. I mean. He got hits upon hits. <laughs> uh, he's, he's an actor, a dancer, producer, writer. Keep it going. Reality star. <laughs> uh, uh, theater. <laughs> the man was only the theater. He's a thespian. <laughs> he could do it all. Recently, he has been going viral for his dance moves and, and, and falling off the stage. I was at that show. I just missed him. No, you wasn't. Yeah, I was at the Lovers and Friends. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yes. Wait, you just yeah. missed him? Like, yeah. I, I just yes, missed him. Yeah, sure did. That's yeah right. so That's right. That's when I tell you, man, this is a legend upon legend, a real one. <laughs> you know, I search. I've been searching him so much, and then uh, you know, this is the first time like uh, I've heard about his depression because I've been seeing him for years, and I have never seen him have a bad day. All right, appreciate that. This is a legend, an icon, mm -hmm. hit maker, okay. and a hist historian. Because we're gonna get he just got history upon history. Yeah. So in case you don't know who we talking about, we talking about the one only motherfucking hey! genuine. Hey! Now, now what I like hey, about recently, what, up, what I like about recently <laughs> is. A lot of people don't laugh at themselves. Oh yeah, and I love the fact that you did not let the internet win. No, <laughs> like, like, never. like when the internet they like, tried to like, because what was it? It was, the first, it was the first. It was the dance, right? Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. I mean, you know what? When you've been in this business as long right. as I have, right. then, hey, yeah, that's skin. all you, you got to talk about. Yeah, I'm, glad. Yeah. I'm glad. So, but no, nah, it was just one of those things. Well, it I happened. had to research <laughs> the reason why people were, were, were laughing yeah. at the dance. And I realized it's definitely two different moves. It's totally. <laughs> so it's the young, it's the young junior move, and then it's the old Jesus. The season, the season, the season. The season. The season. The season. Yes. 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 So, but I love it. Like, like so many people don't laugh at themselves. Yeah. Is, is that something you developed? Like, I had to develop it, man, because I got so many kids and they laugh. Uh, okay. So, so oh. they, they was like, Dad, don't get mad. This is funny. Okay. You can make stuff off of this. You okay, can make so, funny. Okay. So hold on, hold on. <laughs> when did you know you was viral? Like. Who, who hit you at first? I was actually, um, I was in Vegas. I was doing a show with Chris Angel. Uh -huh. And so um, I had a break and my phone was lighting <laughs> up. Right? Right. So I was like, what the hell is going on? Like, I was like, did somebody, you know what I'm saying? You, you don't know what's going on. And then <laughs> when they showed me, I was like, I'm instantly like, I don't care about that. Right. You know, when you right. season in this business, right. yeah. very little things mess with you, right? right? I got to admit, that kind of messed with me a little bit. <laughs> oh, yes, oh. it messed with me a little bit because I, I was like, dang, huh. yo, I was playing. I'm right. chilling. I'm, just, I'm, I'm, I'm doing what I do. I'm playing. And so all the viral stuff, all that stuff was truly like no, for real. Like all that stuff is just new to me. Right. Like I didn't know like right. like once you once that happens, like there's a lot of other things you can do. Right. You can, I, I right. was like, yo. Because right. at first I, I, I felt the way. Right. And then my kids had to calm me down. I was like, no. Dang, you can do this. You can where do did you see it's like that? a rebrand what, what moment. Yeah, right. yeah. What social media did you see it at? But did you first see it? At? They sent it to me. Um, okay. Twitter. Twitter. I think yeah, it was. I'm gonna yeah, say yeah, that. yeah, yeah. I'm gonna say yeah. Yeah. Listen, listen. Yes, yes. I love Twitter. Uh, yes. But I go yeah. on Twitter just.
just to get beat up. Really? Like, I just go, like, whenever he, I, like. He I'm, loves the negativity. Listen, I, no, no, whenever I'm, like, too positive in this world, I'll just go oh, on I Twitter. Stay, I got to stay around you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to Let them fry me real right. quick. And I'm like, all right, cool. Now, you humble. You humble. Go back to yourself. So I was I stay, uh, yeah, I stay like that. So yeah, then, yeah. let's bring it to the lovers and friends. Yeah, absolutely. Lovers absolutely. and friends. Mm-hmm. Um. <laughs> yeah, this, that's when I really I see you would do the response you had the pink on. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. So, yeah, so yeah, what yeah. exactly happened at Lovers and Friends? I, I've been searching. So, I don't know if you addressed this yet. So let, <laughs> let me take a shot. Okay, take a shot. Take a shot. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm get some champagne. Take a shot. Oh. So, mm-hmm. Thank you so much. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Salud, salud, salud. Oh, take a shot of Jack oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Stop touching my shit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so man. yeah, so uh, the lovers and friends thing, man. I was so happy to be a part of the for the second second year straight. Oh, you was there the first. I year? was there. Yeah, I was there the, uh, last year. So, um, you know, we doing our thing. We drinking. We having fun. We right. doing what we do, right. right? And so, me, I'm all. I've always been one of those artists that. You know, wanted to touch the people and uh-huh. go out there. And I still do that, right? Mm-hmm. So, um, this particular situation, I jumped, but right. we know that, right. you know, the big speakers, right? Especially when you get into it, yeah. And, and fry. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. So, so, you know, the handles right uh-huh. there, you know, that dip up uh-huh. on that. I landed. <laughs> but you ain't dip. But I did. You didn't. <laughs> <laughs> so my foot went in there, and that was all she wrote. I almost took the guy down. Was that security with guard, or was that the, the no? That was interpreter. The, uh, the interpreter dude. Oh, uh, and because only thing I knew to do was right. grab. Grab something. Like, yeah. grab Hold on. No, Hold on. Do yeah, he gave but up though. He gave I, up. He was like, <laughs> and I couldn't get mad at him because everybody was like, "Man, he should have caught you." I was like, "He didn't know. I was yeah. grabbing him." So um, the one thing that I did do, I stayed professional. Right. I kept that mic got back right up. here. You were still singing. I kept the mic right. But yeah, you yeah. wasn't sore or nothing? Yeah, man. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I played it off. Yeah, played it off. I played it off. You know how hot them sneakers is? <laughs> what? And, and it was hot as hell in Vegas. Oh, my day. God. Yeah, hell, oh, yeah. my God. But yeah, I mean, it worked out. I finished okay. it. I got back I got back to my room. Had had to, had to soak in a... <laughs> did, did it go viral that day? Or, or? No, it went viral the second day. The second, the day. second day. And I was like, oh, please don't get to do it. Please, 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 please. And I, and, and I knew it. They, uh, and my assistant and dancers and everybody was like, nah, G. <laughs> you, you, you're gonna go yeah. you're gonna... <laughs> So I was like Alright whatever mm-hmm. And so the next day uh, You know it went viral And me learning From the first, first time instant, yes. I was like Just go along Let's with go. it so just, just have fun with it So that's why I, I said We fall down yeah, But yeah, we yeah. get up yeah, yeah. So you know It was one of those things Where you just gotta play with it You know nah, what I mean it, 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 I don't trip at all yeah. I, I, I think I mean I won't say No names of course But there's been many Artists that fail yeah. And so I just I'm, I'm in Admitted into that classroom now. Uh, imagine in the nineties we had social media. You know, how many times we just was falling. Like in the nineties, like you nineties, everything off the front of the stage. Like, Remember, boom, DJ's your face. equipment would oh break my, down. Like we didn't have social media, but yeah. So I'm, I'm, I was so glad that you embraced the, oh, the yeah. joke. You know, what absolutely, I mean? absolutely. So, but let me let me bounce around. Right? Okay, yep. Do your thing. Um, you're considered a sex symbol. Uh, okay. <laughs> I mean, uh, all right, it's okay. what they consider you. Right, right, yeah, right. <laughs> yes, a lot of babies were made. Yes, up. Yes, a lot of babies definitely, were made, definitely. and you made a lot of babies. Yes, absolutely. And, um, uh, <laughs> you made it. How does it feel, like? Because me, unfortunately, like I've made music for the streets, and KRS always said, "Watch what you say, because you attract it." Mm-hmm. And years later. I don't want to say I even wish I didn't make music for the streets, but I wish I softened up. I wish I did. Uh, quickly, I, maybe I, sooner than you did. Like glo- global, like okay, okay. Um, how is it making you know money off of like th- that image of like? Well, for me, man, you know, we started. I started in uh, ninety, so um, I made it in ninety six. So um, you know, I knew nothing else but to make you know, good music and come from the heart, you know, love music, soul music and all that. So, you know, once I started that, um, I didn't know how big it was going to be. You know what I mean? Like you always hope for the best. You don't know what it's going to be. So, you know, for me to have, you know, the the CDs, uh, the albums that I've had with Timbaland and Missy and Mm -hmm. All those great, crazy. Um, man, it's something that I'm constantly thanking, right. thanking God and just the people for because, you know, 
a lot of people don't understand. When you're not popping really here, right. you can go overseas and, and feel like Damn. Michael Jackson. Yo, you know what I'm saying? Yo, hold on, hold on, hold on. Like, like, like that's real. That one more time? That's real. Yo, I tell that to my friends all the time. All it's the like, time, when you, man. When you're struggling in America, they're going to pay you they over there. They're going to embrace you right. over there and you feel like mm -hmm. it was, it's, 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 it's you starting over. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So I've been, man, I've been blessed to be everywhere, man. I went to, um, Nigeria and this was um, back in maybe 99 or something yeah, like I, that and man they had like a, 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 a what you call what you call them a bark, a barcade or what you call it? Uh, when you have so many people following you you have oh, yeah. you have all the motorcycles and all yeah. that kind of what is it? motorcade the motorcade okay. like a presidential and, motorcade yeah right. man and so I went over there and I was like oh my god right. this is crazy right. so we went straight from the airport to the hotel but they told us don't leave us don't leave us oh, don't leave the hotel. Yeah, do, oh, yeah, yeah. don't don't leave the grounds but yeah you can go from here like when you just on your, you know, decline a little bit and you just want to reboot, yep. you can go over there, man, and get so much love and get energy and then it, it, it allows you to come back home and just, you know, uh, start start being real uh, 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 active Productive. again yeah. in, in, in what it is that you do. So, it's a great thing, man. So me still making money and doing what I'm doing. I'm gone ev every weekend mostly. Yeah, every see you. weekend. I see you. Every wow. weekend. Travel like a wrestler. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> you outside. And I'll be wrestling. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so it's all good, man. It's a blessing. So yeah. I'm gonna give you three names I'm, I want you to tell me. Gotcha. Infrared, frosty, and tornado. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! I ducked you. I ducked you. I ducked you. I ducked you. I, 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 I felt. I felt. I did. I felt. Oh my I did. God! You, you know, know what? Uh, I got you. Okay, let me give you some history on that. What's the first one? The first one is infrared, okay. frosty, and, and tornado. tornado. <laughs> All of who is who? Is who? Me? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we gotta hear Make this. Make some noise. Make some noise. Yeah. Oh, hey, you really went back. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I like that. I, like that, I got that research. I was like, yes, this sir. is a good one. Yeah. <laughs> I said it to myself. So here's what it was. Mm -hmm. Um... When I got with Jodeci um, in '90, Devonte mm -hmm. uh, specifically, which is crazy, Devante, the, yes. the yeah. Jodeci connection. Yeah. yeah. So, so um, we, you know, I got with them. Well, like I said, Devonte specifically, and he was coming up with a new, uh, uh, you know, crew called uh, Swing Mob. Swing Mob. Yeah. Swing Mob. Yeah, I got Mob. I got and then, and so, um, you know, he was going around. He was going around the world, going around the uh, uh, the states, and he was looking for his first solo male artist, first male. Group Groups, right. female group, female artists, and all that, and I was pretty much picked along with Missy, Timberland, mm. uh, Magoo, Boogeyman, Tweet, wow. uh, all of us. So the brother had an eye for talent, wow. obviously, right? So um, once we, once I moved up, you know, I had a job. It was like um, eighty nine and ninety. I met them, I think, in eighty nine. And so ninety, um, he was like, "Come on, man, it was, it's, it's, it's time to rock now. We about to about to get." The first name was Infrared. Yeah. So so yeah. So I'm getting through. I got you. so uh, so he uh, he say, um, "Come up." So I think uh, so when I was coming up, he was like, "So what's your singing?" Now? I say, "Scrappy." Right, so he was like, "Why?" So back in the days when I used to break dance, my name was Scrappy GDA, Scrappy Greatest Dancer Alive. Right, so he was a b boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so um, he was like, "Nah, that ain't gonna work. That ain't right, right. gonna work." So those are the names that we went through trying to find a name that actually, you know, represented me right. and who I am as a person. So, uh, 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 Frosty was. I don't know what made him come up with that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Because you, you called. Okay, okay, okay. Come on, nigga. <laughs> okay. I don't know, but um, he, uh, you know, he said that, and I was like, mm. and then so. Tornado was the one you liked. Yeah, a little bit. A little bit okay. I was going to be with that one. Okay. So, um, Infrared was the next one, and you know, he was like, yo, whatever you set your mind to. We was trying to make make sense of it. Right. Right? <laughs> I was like, mm. so then the tornado thing. Um, I was open to that a little bit. I was open to that because the whole the specifics stage, behind that, yeah. there you go. Mm -hmm. So you smart. Look at this guy. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I mean, I mean, I've been trying so, to get this yeah. interview for a long yeah. time. Yeah. So we like you. Yeah. 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Yeah, tornado. Tornado, it was more so about what I do to the stage. Okay. Back then. Right, right, right. <laughs> what I did to the stage. Right, right, right. <laughs> 
<laughs> back then. <laughs> but you still do it to the back, stage. I just a little like slower. That. That's all. Just a little like bit that. slower. Okay. But uh, yeah, so that's basically what it was. And so. Uh, uh, that kind of didn't work out, and so I, I said I've always wanted a name. I, I always three syllable name. There you go. Stop it, man! You've been doing your research. Oh, God damn! I'm really good. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, it was always a three syllable name, and I always wanted to hit it. <sighs> <Yeah. sighs> so I said, "Dang, what best represents who I am as a person, as a man?" And so my name is Elgin. Mm-hmm. So we just took gin, and then I was like, wow. First we, first we started with oh. genuine, uh. and I was like, nah, man, we got this, we got this something. And then, I don't know, he came he, he came, and he was like, what about spelling it different and saying genuine? Oh. And I was like, there it is. Okay. There I didn't is. know it had anything to do with your first name. Though. Yes, yeah, yeah. I didn't yeah, know that yeah, part. Okay. Because yeah, I was like, I want to use that. I want to use that. <laughs> so I got you Because you, cause you, you named after a basketball player uh, Yeah, Elgin Bella Elgin yeah, Bella From the Lakers, yes, yes, yeah. yes My mom thought I was going to probably be a basketball player But at the end of the day, she was right In the, in the sense of me just being some sort of entertainer So right. yeah, it was a great thing And Devonta had a big part in the name though so Absolutely, that's, that's, right. absolutely that's Yeah, because yeah. Yeah, we was like He had a lot of names, man Tornado, uh, 50 mm. uh, All well, kinds of names 50, 50 before 50? 50, yeah, yeah, yeah well, then Missy did that, but Missy you know she always joking Cause uh, back in the days uh, <laughs> I used to wear Fake uh, Some real jewelry And some fake jewelry So she said you were 50%? 50%, 50%. <laughs> oh, you 50%? <laughs> so so that, that, that landed for a while I was like hell no right. Nah nah we can't do that <laughs> But yeah so yeah that's that, like that, that, that was So when 50 Cent came out when 50, Did you ever tell 50 nah, that story? Nah, you nah, gotta nah. tell him that story Nah because it was, so, it was so long ago That was 91 yeah. That was 91 Cause we was, we was all that, on that show together Yeah, yeah. Was on there too. Oh yeah that's right He sure right. was you on there You should have told him that story yeah, That story is fire <laughs> the, So um Uh Let's take it from Rochester, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Y'all are all in apartments. You have yeah. the dungeon. Definitely. Y'all getting it together. hmm And then, well, how, how, how does that happen? Because you're coming from D.C. Yeah, yeah. So coming from D.C., how did, how did you hook up with uh, Devontae to get to uh, Rochester, well, New York? We, well, we were already hooked up. Okay. So we were already pretty much a family. We okay, was, so this was like a writing camp. Yeah. Okay. Really, cool. really, really one of those things where, like... Mm. It, it should be a lot more of that, you know what I mean, as far as crew. Right? Yeah. Because we started um, in the studio together, and we started doing contests, like who can write the fastest, Missy and Timberland. Right. I mean, oh, Missy always won. Missy always won. She always won, yeah. So, you know, it was a great boot camp for years for us to learn, because I was on tour with them. I was on, like, three tours with them. I just learned the business and all that stuff. And they, you know, a lot of people thought I was younger than what I was. I, I was already... You know, a grown dude, but you know, I was, you know, I had 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 a young look, but um, yeah, up in Rochester, I mean, up in uh, Rochester, we were always having, um, you know, write-offs and all that kind of stuff, and it was a great way for us to stay on our toes, shopping, you know, iron shopping, like artist iron. boot camp. Yeah, pretty much. That's what right. it was, and you know, he got that. He got a lot of that stuff from just uh, wanting us to just to be the best at that time. You know what you I mean? Think he was trying to make a Jodeci, uh, or I don't know. No, I don't think he was trying to his make a Jodeci. Yeah, he was trying to, to do Motown. his thing because he like, kind of left Jodeci. Yeah, I was right. like, uh, "What are you doing?" Like, <laughs> right, right, so right. he was really on him trying uh, trying to be. Uh, uh, Andre Harrell, right? Yeah, because right. that was one of his mentors. Yeah, okay, right. and so I said Motown. Close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, <laughs> yeah. <it's not. laughs> Close. But um, so he was trying to make his own, his own Motown, his own own uh, Uptown Records, right. and all that. And so, um, you know, unfortunately, it didn't work out. But but I wouldn't change it for the world, bro. But it was a time where like everyone kind of left. Yeah, yeah. And he was the only one that stayed. I was I mean, the only one that stayed. A couple, yeah. couple of people, I believe one of them is Aaliyah and one is Missy. Aaliyah wasn't with us. Aaliyah wasn't yeah, with Aaliyah us. Okay. Was so it's Missy then. Mm-hmm. And Missy was like, she you, paid you loyal to the default. Yeah, she paid She paid for me to get get back. But did you, did you think she was right when she said you was loyal to the default? I didn't look at it like that. I was looking at it like he brought me from D.C. DC yeah. mm. to nothing. And that's been, a lot of the times, that's been my fault uh, in life, just trusting people as long as I've trusted them. You know what I mean? But I always felt like, look, 
Where am I going? Where am I going to go? People was always telling me, "Yo, come on back home. They ain't going to do nothing." Da, 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 da. But I was like, "I'm here. I, I got to make it. I got to do something. I got to, you know, even if it, even if it doesn't last as long as it has lasted, I needed to do something. Right? You know what I mean? And so, so, so I stuck it through. But it got a little crazy for a while, yeah. and so I was just like, "Yeah." Missy was like, "Yo, you got to leave. You know, if you need money to leave, I got you, and all that." And wow. fortunately, you know, I was able to get back and 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 do the, one of the fastest deals in the '90s, and it was like over the weekend with right. 550 Music, all right? Sony, all right? So, why did you think? Because I know we we all young at the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So why did you think? Uh, Missy and Timberland left in the first place. Was it a, was it about money or was it about like receiving the work? Thing? You gotta understand when we were up there, all of us was really like just doing our own thing. Right. We would talk and all that, but Missy was getting it. She started getting as a songwriter. Mary J. Yeah, yeah. She, she started getting with crazy. Mary J. Blige, right. Kim, Puff. Um, Puff. Right. Uh, she was, she did uh, Raven Simone. Right. That was like right. one of her first joints. And she was with us, uh, 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 Seven O Two, Seven O Two, and she did a lot of stuff. So, needless to say, if you're around our our world, people right. people gonna talk to I you. I've been hearing about Missy a yeah. long time. Yeah, and, she, and, she, and, and she just started doing what she was supposed to do. She did the right thing. Right. She absolutely did the right, right thing. And you know, we we always talk. You know, she just called me when I did fall off the set. Wow. <laughs> she wow. said, "Don't you let the white tell you tell you you ain't no star." I said it's all good, baby. <laughs> it's all good. It's all because, um, yeah, I mean, we spent a lot of time together, man. We spent like six years together. Right. So um, uh, uh, the bond is there. Okay. The bond is definitely definitely there. Never will be broken. Her, myself, Timberland. You know, we still got our got our lives to deal with and all that. But if something goes down, they the, they're the first, and I'm the first to call them. Right. You know what I mean? Because I, I related to a story that you, you told so so bad. That mine's is a little bit different, but um, uh, Pharrell didn't come to my homeboy video, my nothing video, oh, one okay. of the biggest records, and he um, didn't come. And he didn't, he didn't come. <laughs> and he, but he, but he, but he told me, which I believe now, I didn't mm -hmm. believe then. Okay, okay. He said you didn't need me, Nori. Okay. Well, I was like, no, I paid for you. You should show the fuck up. I want you to come. So you, 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 I, I, so when I see you say that you was bad at Tim for not showing up in the video, yeah. I have felt that in my soul. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, yeah, yeah. and I and I. But do you think Timberland didn't show up because? Of, similar to the reason Pharrell Like Pharrell was he, he, okay. he really sincerely thought That I didn't need him Okay what you talking about Which which video Which video Because I remember the first one I think the one you said You paid 50000 No oh, that was no, no 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 That was a misunderstanding I think okay. that was something That the label At that time I was independent at that time okay. um, With an independent label Not okay. me just doing everything But with an independent label And I think she paid him I, I, I right. really don't know About right. that But I knew that Nothing would break our bond We spent Right. A lot of time together, bro. Right. Like, like I know that brother. I know that but he still had to like hurt to. Yeah, I, I, because of what I was told, and that right. was, again, it was just so long. I don't don't remember all the logistics right. of it, but um, of course, with me, we had the same management for a while, and then once I broke away from that management, mm -hmm. he distanced himself oh. from from me a little bit. That hurt me. Okay. That one that is what hurt me. Okay. Um as far as like showing up for something late later on, I I don't think that was really an issue. I was a little more I was a little jealous of some some of the stuff um that he was doing for um uh <laughs> Justin Timberlake. Oh yeah. And I was mm. like that's my shit. Crying your river to, to the man's right. Until, <laughs> until I learned that Justin was writing it. Uh, so I was like, oh, okay, then that's that's a whole wow. different level. So I was just like, all right, I, 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 I'll let that go. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll let that go. But yeah, that was, you know, me and me, me and Tim will forever be connected, and hopefully we'll be able to do something special again, man. I, I, I always respect, shout out to um, Dre and Snoop. And God, yeah, yeah. man, I love that. When I see stuff like that, shout out to um, Puff. And um, uh, even though sometimes things go on, I, none of my business. But when he did that tour, everybody showed up. Yeah. Uh, Kim and yeah. everybody. Bad boy, I was just like, yo. Yeah. I was, and I, first thing I did, I was like, Tim, uh, come on, man. <laughs> come yeah, on, it has to do happen this, with man. Right. But, you know, uh, we still got time. We still got time. Let, let me ask you something that Tank said on here. Uh-oh, here, like, here we go. Here we go. 
on there later. Well, um, <laughs> later, nah. my brother, my brother, waiting for that. But we going there later. Yeah. But something Tank said, he he had sung a a, a, Stan, a Sam Smith song, right? Uh, and I remember he was that. Like, this this when a, when a white person sings about a certain thing, it could go to certain places, but. The genre of black music, like if you majority turn on the radio, mm-hmm. it's a, it's a, it's really a, a lot more negative than it is bad. But <laughs> I mean, it is good, positive, right, right, right. Yeah, right. positive. You know, right, right. Mm-hmm. So, is that something that, that 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 you agree with? As far as what, as far as him saying that it, it, it's more bad. What you mean? Um. Him saying that like a, a white person could sing a oh. ballad and and, 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 and it, it blows, goes, up. It blows like a love a love yeah, ballad. But, 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 I, but if Tank or you sing a ballad, people he, judge it. They don't let it go to a certain extent. He's because, he's absolutely right, but he's not. Uh, sometimes a lot of people got to understand. It's a testament to us not supporting one another too. Woo. You know what I'm saying? We gotta we gotta. If, if somebody comes out with something, and you know, it's sort of, it's sort of like boxers now and all all of that. Like we just have to. To support one another, we we we're so caught up in what somebody is doing negative right. and bringing that to the forefront and bringing that to light. We ne- the good stuff is always overshadowed by bad stuff, and and that's something that I hate. And that's why when it took me so long to say, not because you was right. asking me or anything right. about it, but for me to be open to even do right. podcasts or right. me to be because right. it's like the, the world. The world has changed so much. It's like you don't want to go on something and say something and then take it out of context, and then you you get yeah. fired, you lose all your all your deals. You look. So I just I, I I'm so hands off. I'm I'm let me go do my shows. Let me do what I do, and I go back home, shut my mouth. I don't do all that because you know it's crazy right now. You know what I mean? It's you, very crazy. You know yeah. that? I could tell. That's how you feel. Yes, I'm, absolutely. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna tell you how I know. <laughs> I kept searching, searching, searching all your interviews. Right. And there was so many interviews right. that you weren't even in, in the interview. It was just people talking Talk, about you. Right. And I could right. tell <clears throat> a lot of these rumors you just didn't address. Right. Is that because you feel like you, you're too big for it or is it just because you don't want to be involved with, like with gossip? I, I, I feel like I'm way too big for and it. stay right. above it. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Right. Because, because that's... What, the thing about it is, you know... This nation and everything is built on innocent until proven guilty, right? Nowadays, you're guilty until proven innocent, right? right? So I don't never feel like I have to fight anybody for nothing. Right. You know what I mean? Like, I know who I am. I'm a stand-up guy. I'm true to my name. Always have been. Always right. will be. Right. So I don't feel like I have to fight fight for anything. If somebody thinks something, you've already lost right. anyway. Because as soon as somebody thinks whatever it is that they think about you, that's their truth anyway. Right. Yeah, they made up their they, mind. They didn't already made up their mind. I'm not here to make, to change your mind, nigga. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, look, if you if you, that's that's what you feel right. about, right. keep that. Right. Take that. Take that with you. Right. Take that with you. I, no, I'm absolutely above that. Right. Absolutely, absolutely. Did you ever think like um, that it would be where it's at right now? Like right now? <laughs> like right now? You don't need no talent. Right. You. you you don't. You don't. You don't even. <laughs> I'm gonna stay away from that. You, Go ahead, you don't need. I'm talking about. This is in general. This is not yeah, just art. This yeah. is not just artists. Like a but person. Right. A person can actually uh, like. There's so many women that I go on Instagram and I can look at theirs and they have 2.5 million followers and I'm yeah. like, she ain't make the war report. Right. <laughs> like, how she got more followers than me? And she it's because she's, she's twerking. She's yeah, twerking. She, she, she like, ain't no history. She ain't got no history. Like, and, and, and it's no disrespect. Right. Her. Absolutely. No disrespect to her. Yeah. But I have never seen. This level, like, it's, it's, and there's so many Instagram comedians. Yeah. Like, that's why I always refer to that time with Mike Epps. Where Mike Epps ha- had an Instagram comedian on with us, and Mike Epps just fried him. Really? He fried him. It was, it was, it was, huh? it, who was my man, bro? Yeah, but, good dude, but what good I'm dude. saying is, like, sometimes. Yeah. You put an art. artist next to a uh, artist next to a uh, um you know not a made up a seasoned, artist, but a, a yeah, artist. Yeah. Right. Yeah. That's that's yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you, did you ever think that this it would be to, to here? Huh? Did you ever think it would be here? Like society would be here? You know what? To tell tell the truth, yeah. You 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 saw the fucking recovery. You saw the idiocracy. Yeah. Well, and AI only makes it worse now. AI makes it horrible, <laughs> right? But once the internet <laughs> once the internet came out, That's and it. once you start to see the progression of, if, just go back to Mosh mm-hmm. right? So I knew Tom. Hey, oh, you did? Yeah, nah, I'm just fucking with you. Okay. <laughs> well, everybody, he, I did hear my face party. Yeah, I yeah, 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 yeah. But, yeah. I mean, you can start to see it then. Right. And, and, and 
it was brilliant what they thought about when it came to the just the word followers. Yeah. Just Damn. the word followers. Damn, you get deep. That gave you that gave you such a big platform, right? Right. And so once it took me, yo, it took me to 2015 or 16 to even get Instagram and Facebook really? and all that stuff. Yeah, because I'm old school, bro. Right, I come right. up through with 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 the Michael Jacksons and right. the Princes right. and the New Editions and the Bobbies and all that. We wasn't letting you know when we going to no damn store, or bathroom, right, right. and all that kind of stuff. Right. We we not right. doing that. So right. I never really subscribed to it until I understood it. Like yeah. I was truly old head, old right. school. Like yeah. nah. I ain't doing that I think It actually took away The mystery yep. And the art Of, yep. of an artist yep. Because you it's, it's so exploited You know that Too much it, access it's, yeah. it, You got way too much Access yeah. to uh, uh, Just think if Michael Like What? Oh my god I, I, don't, be, I, I don't think we, I don't do, right. So it's, it's one of those things Man I, I just never caught on Until 2015 You know I love social media But what I hate About social media Is we're all on that same level once we open up that app. Yeah, 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 yeah. It doesn't, yeah, yeah, it doesn't, yeah, it doesn't yeah, matter. It doesn't yeah, matter. Yeah. Yeah. We're all on the same. So there's someone yeah. in, 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 in Nebraska in the basement somewhere yeah. saying, "Norm, you yeah. ain't shit." Oh, I can talk. And to then, then yeah. the street people are gonna retweet him. Yeah, he's like, yeah. "Wait a and, minute." And then viral. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's, 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 so we, it, and, and, and wait, but going back to the you just when you said followers, I'm like the only thing that have followers is cults and religions. Boom. That's crazy. Yeah. Boom. So that's yeah, why I'm saying <laughs> the followers. The followers thing is is was was the key to like. Oh man, this and it's all fake. You know what I mean? Like right. I tell people all the time, you can have a, a twenty million followers or whatever. Put something out mm-hmm. and see how many people get it or whatever. See, that's so cool. That's, that's what yeah, happened yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. see, that's so cool. You saw what happened with hip hop in, yeah. t- in terms of charting. They saying this is the first time in, oh, in yeah, thirty yeah, years yeah, that hip hop hasn't had a number one record. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. It's, it's really it's, it's really a smoke screen. And so I did see it. I, saw, I was like, oh my god, this nah, is. I, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't see it was gonna be this stupid. I saw. I saw it was gonna be this stupid, bro. I saw seen the, the movie Idiocracy. You ever seen that? Movie? Nah, I have not. You got to see the movie Idiocracy. <laughs> Idiocracy. Yeah, they, they it, it, it foresaw a lot of they, this they, shit. They yeah. said that really? the, as we go into time. We got more technology we use, we become stupid. Like, think about it. I don't really know no anybody's phone number. Back then, I used to know. Yeah, you won't remember. I I, I used to know twenty people's phone number. Like, it made me use my brain. The the, the smarter the smartphone got, the The dumber I got. Yeah, you can't retain the the dumber we got. Don't laugh at me. The dumber we all got. We are. I bet you, you can't name five. Numbers in your phone Absolutely right now. can't I can't You can't yep. You probably got one Your mama's That's it I got That's mine. it That's it You're yours That's it That's it I only know Eddie Giggs <laughs> That's cause we he had the same numbers <laughs> Yeah, yeah. yeah. So We're I didn't see that cyborgs up. man We'll tap it Def- Definitely Cause, cause right. we depend on this This is us Right It yeah. just doesn't have a face yeah. This is us I, I Sorry to be off subject But it's on subject Yeah Other day Swear to God <laughs> A therapist friend of mine Said to me you know you got when you get on social media, it's about certain people you follow. So he said he said that, that he had he had he had clients that would wake up in the morning and, and they, they would follow porn stars. Okay. And so when they follow in porn stars, they're thinking about sex. Then you got clients that they follow in kickboxes or, or, or people that's or holding pistols and they're thinking about, and you don't even realize that you're putting yourself into that. Yeah, right? in that mode. Yes. Like that shit, was, like shit was ill when he, yeah. he broke that down to me. And I was like, I can't lie. I immediately stopped following certain people. Right. I was just like, yo. <laughs> if, like, I if, mean, what do we think algorithms are? You constantly, see it, on feed. You constantly, you constantly see, it see it. It's programming. It's all yeah. programming. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's what it's doing. It's programming. That's a good, that's a, yeah. Yeah, it fucked that's me up. So I woke up. up this morning, which I, I didn't use um, the internet the whole time. I was in I was in um, Italy and Paris, so I tried not to use it the whole time. Oh, okay. But then this morning, I woke up and I got trapped right trapped right into that shit. Yeah, I was like, "Yo, right. holy shit!" I'm but okay, you, yeah, yeah, yeah. Your phone is you. Yes, phone yeah. is you. So, but genuine, we want you to know our our show is about giving. Our legends, they flowers while they're here. That. Appreciate you that. are a super legend. We've been trying to get you since this show started. Yeah, we'll your flowers to your face. Oh, okay. hey. 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 your face. Thank you, Ken. Snoop Dogg is better than the Grammy because it comes from his own people, goddammit. That's why I got Hey. Man. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, do you, did you think, you know, because you have a illustrious career. Yes. Did you think you would would have lasted for twenty seven years back then? No, nah, I didn't nah, think. I'm nah, twenty five. I, I knew that 
that song that I started out with ultimately was ultimately was a special song. To my pony. Pony, yes. Yeah. Cause it was supposed to be for a securities intro. Yeah, then you boy, you you bad. You better, <laughs> you better get it. You better and get it. You, you asked Timberland for her two yeah, years. I asked him for um because back in the days you remember, uh, I ain't gotta yeah. tell you, but yeah. uh inter- interludes was a big thing right. for Joe to see and right. um uh even in W um uh uh, Death Row Yeah You know yeah. what I mean So we were doing A lot of interludes And that's what We were following We was called right. The Basement Right So you know Snoop uh, Snoop um, Suge And all of them We had a great connection With DeMonte Because right. actually Suge started managing yeah, Jod- right. Jodeci for that's a while right. And so we kind of We kind of took A little bit from them And mm-hmm. all that And so Um that was just something that was, uh, uh, you know, special for us to do, man. We uh, and, and 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 just to maintain and do the interlude. So once he he was doing some interlude and he was playing, and I was like, "Yo, that's dope, that's dope." And then he played Pony. Now, 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 just picture picture this, okay, without the words though, because right. I always <laughs> felt like Pony, anything could have been put to Pony, and Pony would have been a hit, right? He played that song and he was like, "Yeah, this is gonna be for the, this gonna be for the bodyguards, oh, yeah. uh, something, something." And I'm looking at him like, "The bodyguards." <laughs> <laughs> and it, it, it just, I mean, I just heard it. Right. I was like, "Dude, please give me that." So let me ask you, please <laughs> give me it that. Took two years. You mean you meant that it was recorded already for two yeah, years? Yeah, so y'all it took heard two it. Two years to actually give you the actual record. Nah, y'all heard it in '96. We recorded it in '93. 93, 94. Wow. Yeah, 93, 94. Yeah. Y'all, y'all. And what was and that's funny. That's still popping to this day. You know, yeah, yeah, man. Right? Let's make some noise for that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Go ahead. So, so what happened was when when you asked me about did I did I know whether it would be whether I would be here I didn't know wh- whether I would be here but I knew that song was special so mm. I I what I did when I did it and we finished it uh, rest in peace Static Major because he wrote it yeah. I helped write the verses but he wrote the song so right. I, I don't take no credit for that. Um, um, so he wrote the hook. Straight yeah, he down. wrote the yeah. The hook was already done when I came in there, and I was like, I gotta help you write right. this verse, yeah. these verses, bro. Mm-hmm. I gotta have a piece. Of this. I got to have a piece of that. So, um, you know, um, once that happened, man, I said, um, once once it was finished, it was mastered and all that, and D was like. That's your single right, right there. That's your single. I was like, yeah, it is. It right. is. So once he told me that, I reverted back to when I saw Mo, uh, Michael Jackson on Motown 25. Right. I said, you got to do a step to this Good. that will make people remember this song forever. Right. And so that's what you see in the beginning. I did that in 93. That, that was old. It was right. old. <laughs> so this was old. As, a, as an artist, um, if we record a record and it, it don't drop, most of us give up on that record. Oh, we yeah. think that yeah. It, it wasn't it. Yeah, yeah, What yeah. the fuck made you stay consistent? No, nah, that was just one of the things where De- Devontae was looking for a deal. And, you know, uh. unfortunately, we had, he had like 16 artists, 16 acts. Right. And, and when I say acts, it could be five people in one group, mm-hmm. one people, yeah, yeah. all that. So... And he was going around, and they would always say they wanted me, Missy, and Timberland. Wow. Yeah. So he was going to places, and and they would tell him, no, we want him, we want her, and we want Timberland as right. a whatever. And he was like, if you don't take them all, you can't have none. Right, right, right. <laughs> it took me years to even to know this, well, because him and his boy fell out, I won't say his name, because we, we had... Some falling out or whatever, okay. but um, it was his boy from home, and he was just like, "I gotta tell you, bro, like you could have been had a deal and all that." And then I'm looking at him Is like, Devontae telling you that? Nah, nah, nah. That's his oh, boy. Oh, his boy. boy. Okay, yeah, my bad. So I'm looking at him like, "You a snake?" <laughs> like, why would you, you tell you, me that you, now? Why would right? you yeah. tell me that? Yeah. No, why would you tell me that? Period. Yeah. That's your boy. You yeah. can't. But, if it wasn't for him, again, my loyalty. But, if, if it wasn't for him, you wouldn't even be up here. Why are you telling me that, right. though? So I'm looking at him like. Right. You a rat, dude. You right. you 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 wrong. But he was telling the, the truth. truth. He was telling the truth. And so he looked at it like, I guess, man, you gonna stop these these people's talent, and they are gonna look up and it's gonna be gone. Like like you, we only have a, a small window. We have we. I mean, if you're lucky, once you have that that um, crew behind you. If you're lucky, you know, you can get on. But once that fades away, like, 
it's kind of it's just kind of a done deal for you. You know what I mean? So, um, luckily, I just stayed with him. I was I just stayed with him, and things worked out, man. And Maybe he thought y'all would be stronger as a conglomerate going into yeah, the I situation. Just, I, I think he just had a vision. Yeah. And sometimes when people have a vision, they, they, they don't detour from that vision. And right. Sometimes it, it's a hindrance for the people that he has behind him and with him, which it was. And so that's why a lot of people um, in the crew, we uh, you, you, we understood that. And we had, had to say, I think we did our part in, in the loyalty Category. Right. Now we got to start looking out for ourselves. So Missy was pretty much the first one one that left. Yeah, that's great. Was Missy? Was Missy? Did you ask Missy to, to write on Pony at first? No. Oh, okay. Never, never. Stata was like, "This is mine." Yeah. <laughs> right. Right. Took to the dungeon, right? To the dungeon. Because when I heard it, I knew it was different, right? And I was like, "Bro," mm-hmm. I was like, "What the hell?" Mm-hmm. But I knew it was special. Right. And so I asked Static. I said, "Man, you got to help me write this, man. I don't right. even know what to do with this." Right. But Static was really writing a whole bunch of stuff for um, the albums that was supposedly come coming out and all that. But you know, I didn't even know where to start. Wow. So he was like, "I got you, dog. I got you." So he went down in the basement we had this place called the base that's what our crew was named mm-hmm. and so it was like like two floors down um it was this place called um Dejalon up in Rochester okay. uh New York and so it was a big building and we had studios there everywhere and that's where we got down at you uh, know what I mean so so cuz that record rings off to this day still now yeah. one thing one thing that that, that is, is shocking about it is most people like you know, were you doing shows before that record? Because, because, oh, yeah, yeah. oh you were doing shows. Because most ah. people who write a hit record, oh, who, who has the hit record, mm-hmm. is, is catering to their audience. Mm-hmm. Like, so you were doing shows before that. So you knew that this would work at a show. Oh, okay. yeah, absolutely. Um, I was doing shows since I was like, Ten, get out. Yeah, you know what I mean. So, 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 so my lineage, my my time in the music business goes way back. You know what I mean. I, I've always been an entertainer, like like getting in talent shows, break dancing, doing all that. So, but once I did that, right. oh yeah, I was like, yeah, I got it, I got it, I got. It. When did you work for KFC? I worked for KFC <laughs> before I went up there. I had, you went uh, to I had three, I had three jobs, man. I yeah. used to work um, neighborhood reinvestment. KFC and I used to work at a, a, a construction company. All at the same time. My father. See yeah. you up and Three coming, artist. Go get jobs. yourself a job. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. Go get yourself jobs. a job. Three yeah. jobs. This motherfucker had three jobs. Three he jobs. He was paying for the dream. Three that motherfucker jobs. out here sleeping on your girl couch. Yep. Talking about you struggling artist. You want to be struggling? <laughs> Go to KFC, nigga. This is real struggle. Show shit together. <laughs> make the noise for that. Now, Fat Joe said that the other day. He was like, "If you don't stop with honest, make sure you go get a job." Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, even when I'm, even when I made it with them, um, when I, well, I thought that I made it. Um, in '90, I was working at Champs, and then me and my brother in in New York. You his name had, is. You ain't had Pony out, which nah, nah. Oh, we're, not, we're, not, we're talking about, we're talking about from '90 yeah, yeah, you better, you to '96. You quit that job, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> After Pony, yeah, it was a wrap. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You, ain't, you ain't working nowhere. It was a wrap. Yeah. It was a wrap. Yeah, but I still had that foundation, and now I'm able, just like you saying, uh-huh. I'm able to tell a lot of the younger guys up there now. Right. You know, it's just different now, though. You can just sit at home and and do what you yeah. got to do. Right. Right. You can record an album on your yeah, phone. Yeah, it's different now. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, so I, I'm able to tell that story and know that it it, I, I, it came from the mud. I, I didn't I, I didn't get it given to me. You know and what I mean? The reason about the art era in the '90s, which like these kids have it so good. I remember if I had to, if I wanted my record to be played in London, I had to go to London. Oh yeah, I had to go to. If I if I, if I, if I wanted to play to be played in Virginia, I had to had physically to bring the record. Yeah, to you, you had to do in stores. You had to do yeah. in stores. Oh, yes. yes. yeah. yeah. In stores. Yeah. That's how I met you, right? Yeah, that's, well, how connected. that's what's up. Yeah, that's what's up. Yeah, and in you know, stores. In stores. Not in-stores all of them was crazy. good. Crazy. Some, was some, crazy. some of them were stinking. They don't use weird deodorant. You know, you know them days they want to give you a hug and you like, holy I wish, I wish COVID was out. I wish COVID was out back then. Like, COVID, nigga. Like, <laughs> I had to give so many hugs to stinky people. God damn it. Yeah. I mean, because sometimes they waiting outside for, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, those days know? was crazy, yeah. man. But you had to do all that. You had, you had to, to do, do the morning show. Yes. You, like, you had to do uh, the in-store. Yep, you had to do dinners. You had to do the in You had, you had to, to do the morning show. The promo tour was free. You didn't get paid to do yeah, all that. Yeah, man. It hurt me. Right. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's when I... still hurt. I'm still hurt by doing that. You know how many promo tours 
oh my God. I'm hurt right now. My third, what well, my third, because you, you know, at the end of the day, you have to do promo tours for um, all your records. And I think yeah. my third record is when I found out that um, a lot of people don't understand and know that we made bag. Like now that y'all saying oh, that bag yeah, and all bag? that was us, bro. Oh, wow. Let me let me give you the history I need for to this. Hear it. Let me give you the history for this. Back in the day, you're going to relate. Yeah. Back in the days, a lot of artists didn't care nothing about, you know, the money part of it. We just wanted girls. We just wanted drinks. And we wanted to go to party, right? Yeah, I wanted money, though. Yeah, yeah, well, you probably, <laughs> you, you probably did. A lot of us did. Yeah, I know. No, really, I know. It, right? I'm, I'm playing around. I'm and playing. so, and so huh. um, my boys, uh, Jerry Vines and Cliff Jones, um, back in D.C., you know, that basically came from, you remember back in the days we had, uh, what's the thing? Called uh, when when you on the label, uh, and, and and you go to the city and the, you meet oh, the uh, people. Street raps, the street, street, rap. street the raps. Street oh, raps. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they were saying, it's, yeah, it's street it was street raps or whatever. Yeah. Or a uh, mixer meeting? It, nah, the street raps. But it was another name though. But, but yeah, because because it was two different people. It was the people that ride you around in the van. That's what I'm talking about. It was the, them, okay, them, yeah, them, yeah, them, 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 them. But it was a name for it. But street raps or whatever. Yeah. So so they used to trick us. I don't know about you, but they used to trick us and say, Yo, man, we. We got this club, man. Come, come on, come on, come on, come on. So once I got to, once oh, I got they to, me too. Yeah, yeah, they <laughs> tricked you a little bit. Right? And, but they wouldn't give you no money. Right, right. And so the whole time, a lot of those uh, street reps or whatever they was called, they were getting money for it. And so once, ah. I, and so so once I got a little more season, I was like, man, look, they gonna they they gonna have to pay me. They was like, man, come on, man, you gotta you gotta do this for the for the record for the record. And so. I I actually caught somebody, I won't say the name, I actually caught somebody, and you know when when you go to the bank, they give you like a bag, uh -huh, like a yeah. bag to put your money in. Uh -huh. So I was like, we was like, you got that damn bag, give me that damn bag. The like deposit that, bag. The deposit that's bag. where that came from. So I actually had a, 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 I still got a production company named Bag Entertainment. If you go to my fourth CD, um, uh, Snoop introduced my fourth CD, the, the senior, wow. and he said Bag Entertainment presents mm. Genuine. Y'all owe, owe Genuine some publicity <laughs> Hell yeah. out there using the bag. <laughs> Yo. That came from us, man. That's, that's old, bro. That's old. That's DC stuff. Okay. Okay. So we got a game that we play on the show. Uh oh, Quick yeah, time I, with slime. Quick time with slime. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Time. You want to get on explain them? I, I, I've seen a couple of the games. Yeah, okay. I, 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 I don't know this one. We're, we're, we're gonna give you two choices. Mm -hmm. You pick one. Oh, we're here good. we go. Okay, let me hold it. If you if you pick, if you say both or neither, we drink it. Yeah. All of us are drinking. Say it one more we time. With you, though. We're giving you two choices. Okay. If you pick one of the two, we go. We move on to the next question. I would drink anyway. But if you right. say both, like you can't make up your mind, right. then we all drink. It. All right, cool. Yeah. We don't we don't leave you out there. Yeah, yeah. We take the shot with you. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> By the way, I, me and him don't make up these questions. No, no, no these it's guys are evil motherfuckers over there. It's all uh, good. Our Dominicans and our hey, Colombian producers. So blame, blame these questions on them. Okay, cool. <laughs> By the way, this first one is classic. Is this Pepsi or Coke? <laughs> okay, can I get another one, please? I just switched it. Oh, you did? Okay, cool. Because you know, it was a little... You know the difference between Pepsi and Coke? Yes, you, Pepsi's sweeter than I well, I can put you in a blindfold. And, oh, absolutely. And you'll be like... Do it. That's an 80s baby. No, 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 right no, no. I believe you, I believe you. Believe. Yeah, yeah. All right, you ready for the yep. first one? Yep. <laughs> uh oh Tank or Tyrese? <laughs> 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 you wrong. I was like, 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 I knew you was going to like that one. Mm. Uh, this one I don't know. Snoop Dogg or Jay Z? Snoop. Chris Brown or Usher? Both. I got to take okay. it. Oh, shit. Take it. Yeah. Cheers. 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 Yeah. 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 That was a good one, though. Yeah, that yeah. was a good one. That was a good one. Uh oh, oh, yeah, there it is. Woo. <laughs> there it is. Trey songs or Jeremiah? Trey. Next one. Jodeci or One Twelve? That's gotta be. Oh, shit, this I was taking. I was taking the shot. That's, that's before the last you can one. even get it out, Jodeci. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We need Jodeci on here. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, you want to get the next one? Podcast or radio? Radio. <laughs> Shy or Silk? 
Oh, <laughs> so, so, so. You can ask, ask the next two. This ain't, this ain't hard. Come on, get Nas or Jada Kiss? Nas. <laughs> Rihanna or Beyonce? Oh. <laughs> take a shot. You don't, oh, yeah, I'm going to take a shot. Man, man, you can't influence take, the witness. I'm going to take a shot with that. I, I might want to just take a shot, too, though. <laughs> cheers, you cheers. You want to go against either of those sisters. Uh, oh. Oh, nah. This. Come on, man. Whitney Houston or Amy Winehouse? Whitney Houston. Yeah. That Miss, was easy. Missy or Eve? Missy. Yeah, that's what we Keep Sweat or Johnny Gill? Whoa. Johnny Gill. No! Take a shot. I'm take sorry. A shot. Take a shot. <laughs> I was about to say the cousin, because cousin, he's he from DC, but right. Keith, that's my brother. So I gotta, I'm, I gotta take a shot with that one. Boys to Men or Drew Hill? Boys to Men. <sighs> En Vogue or Destiny's Child? En Vogue. H Town or Jagged Edge? Take a shot. <laughs> take a shot. Uh, Ooh, you, the next one? You're making us drink. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Take a shot. Thank take you. a shot. Pharrell? Hold on, take a shot first, right? Okay. Cheers. Ah. That was for the last shot. Pharrell or Kanye? Kanye. Fab or Pusha T? Mm. I'm gonna drink. I'm gonna drink okay. that one. Yeah. <laughs> you got yours? Cheers. Oh, this is my Mahuana. is a little extra, man. Mariah Carey or Janet Jackson? Janet. I am. <laughs> That was fast. Buster or Eminem? Buster. Wu Tang or NWA? NWA. Wow. <laughs> House party or Friday? Sorry. Uh, uh, Friday. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like that way too. Go ahead. Um, Sauce or Double XL? <laughs> oh, let me drink to that one. Really? I want to say uh, double XL, but so I like it. the sauce too. Oh, okay, it's okay. Good. Sauce is the original. Mm-hmm. Tina Turner or Aretha Franklin? Drink, drink, drink. <laughs> drink, drink, drink. God damn, man. Man, you fucking damn. That was a, that was, that, that's hard, that was a, bro. That was a long ass funeral. <laughs> Aretha, Aretha funeral was long. Oh, as really? It. Yeah, wow. you see it? Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. left, came back, it was still on. Mm. <laughs> Ooh. Got it? Yep. Ooh. Wait, mm. You lost? Yeah, because um, y- y'all used Pharrell twice? or Yeah, you already said to Pharrell. Yep. Oh, okay. okay. Oh, but well, you're skipping. You're skipping, though. Okay, so you, you go back to it. Yeah. Okay, Monica or Brandy? Drink. Drink, drink. Yeah. Drink. Drink. I, I don't have it. I don't have it. Right there, right there. No? Is that it? That, that, that's, that's, that's... James, just give that's, bring them two at a time. Yeah, that's... I do this, yeah. man. That's that's nothing. Okay. Where you at? Oh, oh, okay. Oh, let me get the drink first. Yeah, let's, 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 let's not move too fast here so we yeah, could all yeah. drink. Yeah, yeah, this is just a little bit left. Oh man! <laughs> oh, it's giving me heartburn today. Digital or analog? Analog. Me too. Oh. Tory Lanes or The Weekend? Tory. Thriller or Off the Wall? You said Thriller. Thriller, thriller or Off the oh, Wall? Thriller. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thriller. Dre or Puff Daddy? Drink, <laughs> drink, 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 drink. Oh, yeah. Bingo, Timberland or Swiss Beat? Sprint Timberland. Timberland out there. Like that. Timberland out there. Marvin Gaye or Smokey Robinson? Marvin mm-hmm. Gaye. Al Green or Teddy Pendergrass? Al Green. Michael Jackson. Michael Prince. Jackson. Old Prince? Michael Jackson. Okay. Oops, I'm sorry. You heard you got a Michael Jackson Michael and Prince. Prince. Oh, yeah, oh, we need to hear those stories. Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. We, 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 we are. We are. That's why I'm trying to hear this. I'm trying to decide <laughs> to get to And I got a Nas question for you. Oh, yeah. Bobby Brown or I'll be sure? Bobby Brown. 
Otis Redding and Sam Cooke. Sam Cooke. It's been born. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Cover by Do or Alicia Keys. I'm not drink. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I drink. I drink. Stevie Wonder or Luthi Luther Vandross? Luthi or Stevie Wonder? You think Stevie can see? <laughs> yeah, I so think so. I think so. It's sorry. a big debate on here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm sorry, yeah, Stevie. Yeah, yeah. Like, I think, I think he I've been hearing too many stories. Yeah. Yeah. Now we have, we have to see for ourselves. Yeah. With him. Yeah. <laughs> We had, we had the Osley brothers say that they saw him crossing the street. I said, wait a minute. I bet you he's having a lot of fun with it because he seems like yeah, he got I a sense of humor. I believe so. Listen, listen I call him cross the street. I don't know. And I'm, 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 I'm 2020 busy. Well, you know, you could be legally blind. I have a hard time. Still and you still can see the shapes and everything. Right. And yeah. then Shaq said that he saw him press the... He said he saw him press a button in the elevator. It was just him and him on the thing. <laughs> this is this no, but the no. Isley brothers said he crossed the street. The Isley brothers said he crossed the street. He crossed the street. Well, but, oh, that's not a joke. Like, this is not a right. joke. Oh, no, yeah. no. And Shaq said that he was he he one time they lived, <laughs> they lived in the same building. And, yeah, and Stevie was already in the elevator. I was like, "What's up, Jack?" <laughs> so I don't know. I, I'm listening to Stevie. I'm, I'm with you. <laughs> uh, hey, look, the senses rise up. Yeah, they rise yeah, up. Yeah, 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 yeah for yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Glad this is rise All up. Right, um, new edition or Jackson Five? Oh, I was about to. I was about to. You were about, about to do a new edition. edition. <laughs> I think was... Jackson Five. Okay. Yeah. TLC or SWV? Ah, Drake. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Salute. Drake, Salute. for sure. Thank you. Want to, we both do the last one? Do it. Not Loyalty or, or respect? Loyalty. You want to explain why? Loyalty, I don't, I don't know, man. It's, it's like the respect thing. People can respect you for diff, different reasons. They're scared of you and all that. But I think the loyalty thing, that, that comes from within. It just comes from time and just you spending time with somebody and just not wanting to see that person hurt mm -hmm. and just you going to ride or die for that person. So loyalty for me, it, it, it's, it's everything. Right. You know what I mean? But, yeah, respect respect is good, too. Respect yeah, I think if you loyal, respect comes with it. Respect comes with it, yeah. Cause if take you, a drink to that. That's, yeah, let's take it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's, let's do that. Take, yeah. that. That was a perfect answer. Mm -hmm. I like that. Now, I have to ask you. Yeah. <laughs> At one point, nah, I was like the prince of the hood. He couldn't do no wrong. Oh, prince? Prince or the, okay. or the king. Let's give him the king. Okay. Show that proper respect. Mm-hmm. Then it was one record. Mm -hmm. that they was like, he sold out. Prince? No, you're talking about Nas. No, Nas. He said, oh, Nas. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm going to Prince. Got confused when you said Prince. Oh, oh, that's what you did. Yeah. Talking about Prince. No, I meant okay. Prince of the Hood. Okay. okay, okay. He was king. <laughs> okay. So this record comes out. And this is the time. Oh, you talking about <laughs> this is the time. Buff Daddy yeah. is killing him. Yeah. So, so this suit, is my man. This the, is my man. The shiny suit. Yeah, 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 but yeah. I remember at that time. It was like, man, my man sold out. Oh, don't say and that. Not me. I ain't saying oh, that. I'm saying the people were saying <laughs> right, 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 right. Because of, 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 of we, we, we came it was. from and what happened. Was. Yep. And gotcha. one of those records was you owe me. You owe me you back. Owe me. Where you me this back. <laughs> it aged well. It aged well. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. Yes. but in the beginning, I remember yeah, I seeing so much slack that he was receiving. Yeah. Was yeah. that something that you and Timberland received as well, or we didn't receive nothing? <laughs> That's real. Yeah, I mean, it, was, it was a smash, but right. I'm pretty sure, like, yeah, because because of how he grew up and right. where he was and, right. and rap and all that kind of stuff. But yeah, it worked out for us. And I think it was more of a commercial success for him right. and just put him on a different plateau. I always felt like if you want to change anything and anyone, like, get, get on that plateau and then allow them to see your reality. You know what I mean? And then you can change. You can change them. So right. all the selling out stuff, nah, man. Like like right. the dude, the dude, that's Nas, man. You can't you ever, right. ever say that dude's... Yeah, of nah. course. Of course. Right. Yeah, yeah. But I, I just always wondered... It was a commercial success for yes. him and, and, and all of us. So, you know, just like... And it said, aged well. Yes. But back then, I can't lie. Even me, as, like, as, what as are you my doing? friend... What are you he, doing? Because he was my friend. Yeah. But, but it was, was only the fellas, the, the ladies. Yeah, the ladies oh didn't give a fuck. Yeah. Yeah. And they had genuine yeah, yeah, on it, yeah, so they're like, yeah, 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 the, the, the ladies, the ladies yeah, gave him a pass. Yeah, yeah, but, but the dudes was like, fuck this, yeah, yeah. what's going on? 
<laughs> Why you over there doing? Why you got on a leather shirt? Why you selling? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah and and dudes, right. because that was doing an era where you know, you know, Puff was out and he was doing his thing, but right. he was smart about it. You know, right. he was still like, you better not step to me. You, you know what the deal is. Now it seems like a genius move. What yes. I'm saying is back, back then. then Yes, yes, yes. And, but but guess what? That's what make those icons, those icons. Right. They can foresee the future. Right. You got to look at Master P, uh, mm-hmm. uh, Dame, mm-hmm. Puff, right. you know, all those guys. That's why they are who they are because they already saw the business business part of it. Right. We looking at all oh, the this and that. Right. Nah, they they're they're looking twenty years ahead, 15, 20, 20 years ahead. And, and you, you know That's another thing It's like R&B can make Any kind of music um, Most beautiful music And yeah, not be looked at And but You, you dudes is real dudes On the streets Absolutely <laughs> like, like, like one thing I learned Still about me R&B, it's cold One thing man. I learned, learned About being R&B Like, like oh. Okay obviously I came out with, 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 with rappers And the one thing I, I've seen, I, I remember having a show with you. I'm sure you don't remember. <laughs> okay. But you had panties just flying on stage. Yes. And I was just like, how the fuck do I compete with that? <laughs> <laughs> like, what the you, fuck? You're getting blunt thrown there on is, stage. <laughs> I got a DJ. There's people throwing weed at me. This, this, this motherfucker had bras and panties. <laughs> and I was like, what? I can't get on after that. Like, what the. But that, that it was like like I remember you and LL was like very hard. That's my man. Like very hard. Like LL would he would change because remember we we, th- we thinking one mic you know a DJ and I remember LL having a show and him giving out flowers okay. and I remember yeah. having a show with you and you <laughs> receiving out <laughs> panties and I was just like this was it was I did not start research I don't research you. As, as we get closer to you saying you're gonna do this interview, and I'm researching you, and I realized that that was at every one of your shows. Yeah, yeah. I thought it was just at the show that I did with you. Uh, nah, that, that was at. Well, you thought that was the panty show? Or <laughs> yeah. And then that was a multiple, yes, I did. Yeah, yeah. And then I realized. So was that like something you you strategically said that? No, that was multiple encounters, man. I never really uh, strategically planned anything like that, but I always remember it. You know, my mom back back in the days is saying that. That, you know the ladies who throw panties for Marvin Gaye. Right. Yeah, yeah, that's been going on. That. So, um, you know, I never, I, I never really planned that, but I welcomed it, mm-hmm. of course. You ain't say no. Yeah, I ain't say no. Yeah, don't do it. Going back. Yeah. Nah, nah. So, I mean, it was, it was. <laughs> It was it, it was it was a situation where I, I was just happy that it was happening to me. You know what I mean? So yeah, because, yeah. because of your heroes in the past. Yeah, uh, absolutely. Rappers don't know LL, except for LL. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really LL, that's the man. That's yeah. the man. Yeah, yeah. man. Oh, and he transcended always. it. Like he was yeah. still, always. you know, street with it and still. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a good dude. Shout out to LL. Yes. Man. So, is there anybody that you wanted to work with and you didn't get a chance to work with? I really, really. Where's the camera? What, yeah. Is there the camera right here? I really want to work with Mary J. Blige. That is so dope. I really want to work with Mary J. Blige. That is so. Dope. You know what I mean? I, 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 I actually, and also Mariah Carey. Okay. Um, I. I know you. I know how you feel. Come on. I'm gonna look at the camera, Mariah Carey. I want to do Fire and Desire with you, mm. by, uh, by Rick James and, and Tina Marie. I, I, I want to do that with you, and I just want to do anything with, with uh, Mary J. Blige. Wow. Anything. After that, no. The two people that I've always wanted to do something with. Um, they're no longer here That's Michael Jackson and Prince But I was able to pay homage to them While they were here wow. The first CD that I did it, uh, Genuine the Bachelor I did uh, When Doves Cry wow. The second wow. one I did 100% Genuine I did She's Out of My Life wow. I wanted to just to pay homage to them While they were here mm. You know what I mean Just like you did with the flowers right. And all that yeah, that's, that's, right. that's, that's, that's a great thing You know yeah. what I mean And so Because they A lot of artists don't understand how 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 much we inspire people on a daily basis. There's somebody right now in their garage or whatever on on their laptop now. I'm saying garage because I'm thinking back in the yeah, days yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> where they're on their laptop. They want to be the next Pharrell. They mm-hmm. want to be the next Timberland. They want to be the next Kanye. They mm-hmm. want to be the next whatever. And so those are the two uh, guys that really truly inspired me. Prince and, um, Michael. Prince and Michael inspired me to uh, set out on this conquest and just to go on all out and say this is what I'm going to do there is no second plan right. you know what I mean so I didn't have no second plan right. I was like no I'm doing this 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 is it so you, know you got I mean? to meet Prince 
Got to be Prince one time. They heard the covers, both of them. Uh, the covers you did. Michael, I didn't. I, I've never met. I wanted to. That's that. That was like when you saying uh, which one or whatever. Michael is always first to me. You uh, know what I mean? Right. After Motown Twenty Five, you know that bulb that goes off in your head or turns off, turns on, and on. You know, in your head to let you know this is what you're supposed to do. Right. That's what happened that night. I was a kid. Well, let like, me ask you about Prince. Yeah, you met him. Did he float in? He floated in. He floated, he floated in. in. Yeah, he I feel floated. like he never he, purple smoke. Like he it. never walked. I feel like he had a hoverboard back then. <laughs> no, nah, I was actually in uh, what is it? Minnesota? Where is that? Minnesota. 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 Where, Lake Minnetonka. Minnetonka. Yeah, Lake yeah, Minnetonka is that? Yeah. So, and so we love I was at stories. his club. Well, I was at a club, uh-huh. and they said he was coming in to do a set. Uh huh. And so I just finished the show there. So I came in there, and I, I was like, Oh my God! You know, we all turn into fans when it comes to back yeah. back in the days. We all turn into fans when they come to Michael Jackson and Prince yeah. and Janet Jackson of course yeah, of yes course. so uh, what happened was I, I walked in and I was in there and I was like yo so when is he coming it was like 2 o'clock in the morning so he came they was like he here he here he here and I was like oh man I'm I'm scared sweating did you see purple shades oh, everything I saw everything okay. I saw purple shades purple light <laughs> <laughs> so it's from, uh, purple Hennessy. I'm getting hype on the story. Go ahead, continue. So, so he came up, right? And Thank so, you. listen, this is this is real. Like, 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 I'm not playing. I'm not playing. Like, I was up. Uh, it was on the sec- second floor. And I think like he had he had trap doors or something in the <laughs> club or something like well, he just, I think he he was doing he did this just to say just just for people like myself and artists to say this guy is this different. guy this, yes, this guy yes, you know yes. what I'm saying so I'm walking and so he just I swear to God he just appeared, appeared. he just <laughs> appeared kind of like the, the, the Dave Chappelle's kid. I'm serious he just appeared and I turn around here and you know the deep voice and then I, I remember um, somebody said did you just say Prince had a deep voice yeah, yeah he okay. got the deep voice let's get back voice. to that very deep right. voice hold, hold on. on so I remember somebody I forgot <laughs> who said something he said don't look in his eyes right <laughs> don't look in his eyes <laughs> Don't look, <laughs> don't look in his eyes. Don't look in his eyes. Just don't look in his eyes, right? So, <laughs> that other artist saying that too. That's weird. Man. This dude was like, for, this was different. All right. So, so he says, uh, I don't remember what he said. I'm not gonna lie. He he said, baby, yo or G or something. And I turn around and I see, I I, I, I see him and I immediately said. <laughs> You did not make eye contact. <laughs> did not make eye contact. I said, I said, oh my God, I, I'm, I'm doing it. Oh my God, dog, it's so great to meet you, dude. <laughs> great, oh man, thank you. All. Man, listen, you know I wanted to pay homage to you. I'm doing this. He's looking at me like you. I'm like this. Yo, I'm paying homage you looking to you. Down his but I'm looking down, I'm not looking at you. And so, because <laughs> I'm still a fan. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. You know? So, um, uh, and, and he told me, he was like, I don't usually let I don't usually like people to do my songs. And I was like, my I was hurt. My heart oh. dropped. And then he said, but you did a good job. I was like, oh, thank you. Damn, that was so the here's what happened. That was here's the magic. Here's the magic. So my people was there, and I was like, yo, he said, because he was like, like, like I was so talking he knew to you him. covered his song. I was talking to him, right? right. So I was like, <laughs> thank you, dog. And I was like, yo, did you hear that boy? I turned back He's around. Gone. He's gone. He's gone. Disappeared. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just I like said, Prince. Oh my God. He didn't. He didn't stay around. He didn't like that. Was uh, that's my friend's story, and that's the true story, bro. God damn. Everybody who ever we ask who ever met Prince, they always say they he got floated. The story. Like, 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 like they got like a, like a crazy story. I have yeah. never met Prince, yeah, and I've never met MJ. Wow, I've never met Tupac neither. Wow, I you did. Ever, you met Tupac? Yeah. It's Tupac, and Tupac. Uh, well, was it when you said you guys were dealing with Death Row? Was yeah, it around that time period. Yeah, um, the first time I met Tupac, um, he came in the studio and we were in, um, uh, uh, I know you know this New York. Place. Let's go. Manhattan Center or something. Manhattan like that. Center, okay. That, right? Am yeah, I saying studio, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. So um uh Devante, uh we were in a studio with Devante. It was me, Static, and everything, and Madonna was in there. Madonna was in there. This is when he was messing with Madonna or something? I guess. Yeah, there was yeah, I'm, I ain't getting in their business. I ain't getting in their business. 
skin. Dang it. Everybody know. But yeah. <laughs> but uh but yeah, he came he came in. And she didn't go back. It's true. Once she went black, she did not go <laughs> back. Right. I'm sorry. So I'm he came, he came I'm in. My bad. He was like, yo, what's up? And all that. So that was like one of my first times. And then my boy that wrote um Pony, uh-huh. he was a big, huge fan Tupac. of Tupac. Uh-huh. He walked in there and he was his eyes was like. He was gazed at him. I was like, "Wow, dude!" Like, so yeah. He was. He was like, "What's up, little man?" I was like, "Yeah, you don't even know I'm older than you." <laughs> <laughs> Mark said he called you little man. He's like, "What's up, little man?" Oh, okay. like, yeah, what's up, dog? <laughs> but yeah, I mean, he was always um, a, a cool dude, though, man. Okay. Always a cool dude, man. And it was a couple, a couple times that I met him because we were always um, connected with Death Row, bro. Mm-hmm. Um, I was Great. like, I was like one of the. I, I was the first. Uh, uh, artist with Danny Boy on his first single. That's me on the hook of Danny Boy's first single. So, and, and Danny Boy was the first R&B solo singer, artist right? off of Death Row. Mm. And so that's how all of us really like connected. You know what I mean? Wow. Is it true that you was at Biggie's party the night? Biggie yeah, died? yeah. I heard the shots, though. Really? Wow. Yeah. Uh, well, really? Yeah, yeah. The Soul Train um, Awards, right? Yeah, it was Soul, Soul Train Party. Awards. We were, um, and um, a lot of people were having that story, and all the other specifics and stuff I don't know about, but it, it wasn't because it, it was, you know, somebody fighting or never. It, it was like a fire hazard. And so they was um, too many people in the venue. Why wow, they evacuated the party? Yeah, they evacuated okay. the party. Yeah. And so, you know, it was so hard getting. Um, your cars for some for some reason, and so if you look on um, the internet, they'll they'll show you they'll they'll show they say the names. This person was there, and they'll show us dancing and all that kind of stuff. And yeah, yeah, we actually heard heard the shots, but we didn't think it was L.A. This is this is what this is what happens. And so we went back to this hotel called the Nico, but we used to call the Nico it the hotel, Negro. Now it's the SLS. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. So first street was the Fat Burger. Absolutely, yes, yes, absolutely. Yes, yes. And so we was over there, and that's when we found out. Yeah. What happened Who it was And all that So yeah It was it, it was a crazy night Man But the night Before that It was just Man it was just fun right. It was just very Very much fun Yeah But we were there Me, Missy Timberland um, Aaliyah um, wow. uh, uh, There's a lot of Aaliyah people Aaliyah was there I th- Yeah I believe Aaliyah I believe I know Missy was there It was me, Missy Because we came together Me, Missy um, Timber. I believe Timberland was there um, But yeah We came together Alright that, and you said you heard it We heard it We heard it Dang. We heard it Yeah because We, we stayed until that happened All Right Like we were evacuated Everybody was like Okay yeah leave da, da, da. It's, it's too much And all that And we heard it But we never Thought about it We never Because we was on the other side We were on the side That they were uh, uh, Pulling up the cars Or something mm. And so we actually heard it We actually heard it And, and, and how did that feel You know Um Although, like you know, I I kind of engaged with, with the East Coast, the West Coast, mm-hmm. a little bit on on the record, but I never got to experience none of that. I mean, yeah, how did you feel like knowing that? Because I never uh, until Biggie and Tupac, like we didn't think their beef would have got that far. It was real, like it was that. battle rap. Right. It wasn't really right. about like testing a person's coast or testing a person's city right. or testing a person. Period. It was just battle rap. It was just like, yo, I think I'm better than you, so I'm right. gonna say I'm better than you. Right. But this was the first time that it turned. How right. did how did that feel for you? Not only knowing what's going on, but you knew Biggie too, right? Yeah, yeah. You, you knew definitely, Biggie. Definitely. Obviously, that's why that's party. Yeah, we don't talk. Uh, you got to meet Tupac. Yeah. Um. So how did that feel for you personally? Like you, like like damn, like. Knowing that, both sides and knowing where it went, I, I, I'm just gonna be a hundred with you, man. Like after after Tupac, we always was like, as far as us as artists. I mean, I'm a art, I'm a I'm a singer, I'm a R&B right. artist. I ain't yeah. in, in that. Right. But I was always like, why are they out there? Right. Why in are they? LA. Yeah, I was like, why are they out there? But you know, it was what it was. You know, wars was given and everything. We was just partying and all that. But it made us. Not only me, just everybody that were that that was involved as far as on, on the entertainment level. It just made us realize, like, look, this is real now, right. you know. So we got to really, you know, we actually thought after pop, like, we thought it, it was subside a little bit right. and all that. But after that, we really were like, yo, I didn't go out to L.A. for a long time, man. And you lived out there. Hey, no, nah, well, I had, I had a place out there later, later, later. on, but nah, nah. Yeah. I, I, I frequented uh, a lot, but I, I didn't have no place out there. I remember me going out there 
and after that happened, mm-hmm. uh, and it was still like four years later. Like, yeah, I was out there in '98. I think um, apprehensible, it, right? You like? And no, 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 I remember the record label was physically not let me land without security. Right? Like they would have. Right. As soon as I landed, they would force because I don't know if they had insurance policy on me. I don't. I don't know at that time. <laughs> right. But you know what right. I mean? They probably did. They yeah, probably like, did. Like, yeah, it was crazy, yeah. bro. So, it like, was they, crazy. They would not let me like travel to uh, without that. Uh, without that. Yeah. Same. The same. How was it? How, how was it? Yeah. For, again, we are. Be honest, it's just totally not the same yeah. like that. But we we had, we always had our antennas up because we didn't know at that point what it was. Yeah, it was like was, I don't yeah. care if you are be honest, R and B, rap or whatever, we gonna get you. You right. know what I mean? But um, for uh, you know, it was it was one of those situations where we just had to you know just keep our eyes open. You know, be always stay alert and make sure that we're on our square and and, and, and not slipping. They, right now, they're saying like rappers. If you're a rapper, that's one of the most dangerous jobs in America. Absolutely. Um, do you feel like? Do you feel like that statement should be famous? People is is uh. being the most dangerous job in America because because if a person would try to get me, I think that same person would try to get you. Is that fair or, or they gonna say, man, genuine? Nah, fuck man. my girl back in the days. I'm, I'm gone. <laughs> nah, I'm just playing. Well, that's <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah, but I don't think it's the same thing. I think okay. you know this, this distinction between rap and R&B is the distinction. Like it's totally separate. And what are the tracks? Yeah, and the yeah, crowds. Yeah, the yeah, it's, right. it's not the same. But you still got to keep your head on the swivel. You, you, right. you, you can't think it's sweet. Right. You know what I mean? Because right. you don't know what you've done. Just right. like you just now said, that's that right. that's real. Right. Like like that. That stuff happens. Yeah, somebody. Yeah, somebody you don't could, know yeah. what's going on. And social media made it worse because people it worse. think they know you even more. All they gotta do is say it. Then it right. it, 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 it could be a woman that you never even knew. She just followed you for your whole life, and her man is sitting there thinking, "Oh, this." You know what I mean? You probably never even touched. You probably never <laughs> yeah. even met her. They make you know what I mean? But, but she's it obsessed with you. It he, he sees that, and he sees you somewhere lacking, and you know. What I mean? And I don't understand when guys do that. Like, like at the end of the day. If that's something that's just happening between your woman and yourself, why are you mad at the guy? Mm. Like, don't, don't, like, for what? Yeah, like, yeah. Check, yeah. check that. Yeah. Check that. Mm-hmm. Don't, don't mess with that. I don't know you. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? You ain't my friend. Mm-hmm. So, um, I, I don't know why guys do that, but a lot of guys do that. That's, that's Has that, that, that ever happened to you? Someone confront you and say, man, you, 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 you ever heard that mate skip? It's like, yo. That had to have happened to you. Yeah, that, you know. that had to have happened to you. <laughs> like, yo. There had to be a dude that blamed yo, you. Yo, genuine, leave my girl alone, yeah, yeah, genuine. Yeah, yeah. Leave my girl alone, <laughs> genuine. <laughs> <laughs> but you ain't gonna get but so close to me. Yeah, you know yeah, 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 yeah. You can say what you want. Right, right. Right. All right, I'm sorry. Uh, you know, I'm sorry. But not, not in person. That's never happened. Or, no, that oh, happened. Okay, fuck. My bad. He didn't really talk about it. All right, all right. Of course, that that has happened. But again, I don't know. You do, right, I don't, right. and he's not my friend. Right, I don't right. know you. Right. Like, check your girl. Right, what are you right. talking yeah, about? Yeah, exactly. like, I, don't, I, don't, I, ain't, I ain't hearing that. You right. know what I mean? Whatever. Mm-hmm. I got guys that's gonna do what I need them to do. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> what happened? Look, that's 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 that's, that's the niggas. Them niggas hating on you right now. <laughs> 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 like, happen? you ain't gonna say sorry, genuine. <laughs> <laughs> that's the spirit of the angry, angry boyfriend. <laughs> I don't even know how that happened. <laughs> All right. Jamie, can we get some towels? Yeah, we need to get some towels right here. I got napkins here, too. Oh. Yeah, that definitely has happened, brother. Yeah. Yeah. And, but that's your job, is to make music and make... Mm-hmm. No, you didn't get me. You didn't get me. You didn't get me. You didn't get me. Because that's, that's your job Is to make people Have babies through your music Right Like you right. know how many people what Probably That's your babies. job And he's yeah. like, your job. No, But it's true though Like you know, many, you know how many Babies you're responsible Besides your own You know what I'm saying mm-hmm. yeah. Like because of the music You make You're making the music Right To get People in a a, 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 mood, mood, a mood, a mood, a mood, yep. and hopefully, I mean, that's what R and B always was. It was like, yo, play. I always have been, always yes. will be. You know, what I mean, we, th- this is what we do. We we try to we try to make the music that allows you to feel where you are and just you know uh, make love and all that. Right. You know what I mean? Because that's what R and B is, man. We right. we're not trying to tell you to go shoot nobody. No, right. no try, we got this money, we got this, we got that. But you know, at the end of the day, man, it's all about love. It's all about respect. Thank you, Jamie. Right. Appreciation. You know what I mean? Like, so, like, like my foul music I used to make. People just come up to me and say, "Man, I went to jail in your shit." I was like, "Damn!" <laughs> like, "Damn, why?" Like, people come up to you and say, "You made me go out there and shoot somebody." <laughs> yeah. But did, people gotta come up to you and be like, "Yo, genuine." Three of my kids is because of you. I right? didn't, I didn't get a lot of respect from the brothers until I did same OG. 
same OG. That's what the brother yeah, said. Yeah. They gonna stop hating on. After after that, the they brother said, was like, "They said you had S girl." He was like, "Yeah, hey, you, you, yeah, you got S girl. You, you, yeah, you, you like skinny nigga. Yeah. Da, 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 da. But, but, but you alright. You alright. <laughs> <laughs> I said, alright. I'll take whatever it is. It's all good. It's all right. good. But yeah, man, that, um, I didn't get too much love until you know, especially from the brothers, until after same OG. You know what I mean? So you telling me that, that you had shows in the beginning? The shows is ninety percent females. Ninety five. Yeah, I would say even more than that. Yeah, ninety five. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's a good thing, though. Yeah, I, I mean, yeah, because there's no violence. Yeah, absolutely no not. Violence. Nothing but love. Nothing but love. Nothing but love. Nothing but love. Holy shit! Yeah, 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 yeah. Ninety five percent, man. Like back in the days, um. Yeah, man, because it was, um, you know, a lot of the promoters that uh, we were dealing with, they knew how to, um, you know, piece it together. That's why when you said earlier that you was on a show with me, I have been on those shows. Yeah. I was on the shows with Lil Wayne. Right. And yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Cash Money. And I was like, why the hell do y'all got me on the show? <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> it's vice versa, yeah. <laughs> yeah like, what the hell? Yeah. And so that absolutely happens, man. So that's why when you said that, I could relate. I understood that, man. But that's why Lovers and Friends is a good concert. Great, because, great, because great. Because it's like six different stages. Absolutely. Everyone's crowd is going to go to their different stage. Yes. Yes, like yes. I, be, I believe I um, had Dipset on, on, which made sense on my uh, on the stage that I performed mm-hmm. on, um, and I forget who else was on my stage. Who was there? Um, who else was on my stage? Who? Chingy. Like it was like they had like you know my my kind of like my, this thing is weak. Oh. So it be like if so, I did like, like how my kind of uh, um, era of hip hop. When you hit the stage, was that a R and B stage? I really don't. I don't really remember. Don't I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I just, I was going, I was going there, they don't thought that. No, I don't. I, I really don't remember. I think it probably was though. I think they uh, had it set up for. No, I think Chingy was on my stage. No, nah, that was my stage. It was. It wasn't on my stage. No, Chingy was on your yeah, stage. Chingy's on, unless Chingy yeah, running around on everybody's stage. stage you know? <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was rappers on. Yeah, it was rappers on the stage. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I think the I, I think the uh, the time thing I think they try to do also as far as like like the uh, years nineties right. the eighties I mean uh, right. like the yes, eras, yes, yes, eras, eras. Yes, that's what I believe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I think that's probably what it was. And I didn't actually know that was Usher's concert. You didn't know that? No. That was yeah. No. Yeah. Because oh, now, uh, was, even on the flyer, it's got Usher big as hell on the, on the top. <laughs> and that's his song. That's his song. That's his song. There's plenty of songs hey, that's hey, named after hey, something. He owns but Vegas hey, right now. Let me just tell you something. He owns Vegas right now. They were so professional. Uh, I was like, owns it, I, I, owns I was like, wait a minute. Yeah. I, 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 I got a big Usher up. We got a big oh, Usher Oh, yeah. That yeah, was definitely. They were so They knew when to get the carts from this point to this point. Like, Like, you could tell. That it was an artist running the show. Yeah, Although I didn't see Usher, I, didn't get to, I saw everybody but Usher. But Usher, okay. And Little Kim, I didn't get to see the Little Kim. Uh, yeah. From, huh? We were on the same stage. Oh! You was on the same stage? I was on the same stage. Give it up for Give it up for Give it up for Give it up for Yeah, but you could tell that was, afterwards, I, 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 knew, I, I noticed that. Our artists want to take care of another artist. We okay. don't really, we don't really want to um, be put in that position where we can't can't take take care of each other. So right. I'm guessing so he knows the needs. He knows, yeah, right. he knows what it is. Right, has right. there ever been a time you went to a show and was like, man, this shit is not to put together. Let me get the fuck out of here, or you just. Yeah, <laughs> I walked out of some shit before. Uh, uh no. after I performed, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, because like, like if you pay me, you you're know, already there. Might yeah, as well get I'm the other already half. there. I, I, I'm gonna do what I'm supposed to do. Okay, you know, so but even if it's unorganized, you don't really give a fuck. You just I'm gonna. <laughs> you got my money? Yeah, you got my money. <laughs> you got my money. Okay. We're gonna do what I gotta do. Oh wow, oh wow, yeah. I don't stay. I don't stay now, especially with the tours and everything that I'm on. I usually never stay. I go do what I'm supposed to do mm-hmm. because pretty much we tour with each other um, a lot throughout the uh, summers and all that kind of stuff. So I've seen pretty much everybody show. So I don't tr- I don't really stay a lot. I, I go do what I'm going to do, right. then I'm out. Let me ask you, mm-hmm. what's on your rider? 
<laughs> um, it's, that's a specific. I actually um came up with a show called Rituals and Riders, and I was trying to come up with, you know, uh, saying, you know, what outlandish things that some of us artists come up with to have on, on ride. our rider. So, and there's there's really no, I'm sorry, that, that, that part of it is not, you're not going to be entertained by that at all. Don't tell me. Water, juices, so Coca-Cola, I'm Coca-Cola, Coca-Cola, Henny. You, you ain't got just the yellow the M&M's. Yeah, yeah, I know you what you're talking you about. You ain't got just that? You ain't got that? I know what you're talking about. You only had two cases of Snapples on his yeah, rider. Nah, nah, Yo, nah. I ain't going to lie. I not, to, me, not me, not me. You don't got a crazy rider? Not me. I don't. I don't do that. You don't have a crazy rider. No. Yeah, I went to seafood a little bit. That's about as crab legs. That's about as a little crazy. It's a little crazy. Yeah, it's a little, a little crazy. crazy. Yeah. Specific. Little yeah, crazy. yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the room smelled different. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And then, then you got to receive the panties after that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah, that, yeah, that was yeah, about the most. I went to, I, I went to Japan after LL, mm. and the promoters loved me so much. <laughs> oh, I said after LL. After LL. Because he must have had the worst rider oh, ever. Oh, my God. He had them getting green apples. Oh, God. And in Japan, I guess that's exclusive. Oh, so I guess God. like r- red apples is standard in the world, and mm-hmm. green apples yeah. is not something like that. It might be through the backwards, but he had them doing some crazy shit. Wow. And I had cigars, Hennessy uh, at the time I was a Hennessy drinker. Course, had cigars, Hennessy, and water. Yeah, and maybe a Gatorade. Yeah, Gatorade. Pino that, at one point. Pino that was it. Simple. No, no, no. That's not talking about when Back Japan. Then, when yeah. I went out to LL. Oh, okay. so you telling me you don't got no crazy shit on your rock? Yeah, crab legs. Okay, well, just crab legs. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, okay you crab legs. Yeah. That's that DC shit. Yeah, that's exactly. That DC shit. Yeah, that, that, y'all bought them all. Yeah, more yeah. Maryland. Yeah, love them crabs. Crab How legs. has it been seeing your your audience from the early '90s grow up with you? Um, you know what? Throughout my my tenure in in this business, man, it, it's always been a blessing for me to just see the people grow with me. Mm-hmm. And I've always said I'm not going to be the the artist now that's trying to do the things that the young cats is doing right, right. now because I think that's corny. Like right. I I would never do that. You know yeah, what I mean? So it. I think the people that's been with me throughout my time in this business, of course, they're still here. You know what I mean? My 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 uh. Age thing is like twenty five to whatever. You know what I mean? Thirty on. So I don't I don't I don't I don't really buy into, you know, just doing what everyone else is doing. I think that, you know, as an artist you gotta continue to build with the people that's been following you for the years. Right, that's your foundation. Yeah, your right. foundation is there. So cater to them. Don't try to they got who they have. They got right. who they want. They got who they like. Don't try to be that. You know, continue to move on your your um, your legacy and keep moving in your time. And and people will support you. You just got to right. do the things that they 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 feel is interesting and you know and and and, and doing the things that you've been doing. But at that point, like when the people constantly you know uh, support you they have to realize that at the end of the day you should not change they shouldn't change they should go they're, they're going to be there and hopefully they'll, they'll just still support you and, and how is it having a cult following because that's what it seems like i don't have no cult okay. following i don't, I don't think, say a cult following i, I hope i, I did I, I wish i did following. i wish i did a loyal following it's, it's is probably a better loyal following some people might take it as a cult we just said earlier yeah 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 about the followers and what did you say sometimes it's, 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 cult, it's a cult it's or a religion cult, is what, cult, what i know to be have followers but, right, you know, right, right. when you when you out 25 years most people say in five years they tired of this yeah, artist yeah, oh shit yeah. two years Facts. right now six months Facts. you yeah. know what I mean right now six months <laughs> this shit is disposable music disposable yeah. music and yeah. for you to have such a illustrious and you know career that lasted that long it has to be like seeing you like you go you going back to Minnesota you probably see that same dude that was there 10 years ago and that shit is dope Constantly. seeing that same the female that was there fans. Like and, the and they growing kids. they having kids now like Constantly. How, that, that shit has, has got to be an uh, amazing feeling how, how does it feel? it totally feels great to have have the following that you have man right. and just when you say the uh uh cult thing and all that that's that that's great man right. that's great because it, it 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 it's a testament to you know what you've done throughout your career and mm-hmm. the feelings and the people that you've touched 
Mm. And so that's that's vital. That's important in order for you for you to have longevity. Right to have a real so, career. So so as long as you do that, I always tell these young cats, like uh, try to do timeless music. Mm. Don't 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 do flavor of the month. Right. Do do timeless music because right. I've seen them come and I've seen them go. How about that? Right. I've seen them come and I've yeah. seen them go, and I'm like, wow. And, 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 and this is crazy. Probably when you seen them arrive, they were cocky. They were very and, cocky. And they, they were and cocky. They cocky. Yeah, yeah, they 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 me in and I, I was just like oh okay just always if you just be you also but also remain the humble person that you are right. because it can be here today and gone tomorrow yes. one of the one of the craziest things that happened to me was when I, I went up to Sony and I asked them I was like release me you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. You know how it is mm-hmm. when mm-hmm. a new whole yep. team comes in, takes oh, over, the guard. takes yep. over a, a label, yep. and they're not even talking about you. They don't yep. even they, have. They no didn't regard. sign you. They didn't sign you, so yeah, they, they don't like, have no. They don't have no attachment to you. To you. Yes. They put on the artist yes. they want to bring so, in, right? So I'm, I'm looking. I'm just like, golly, man. And that shit happens like every five years, and I'm like, okay, I'm sorry. It, yeah, yeah. And, 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 and so I went up there, and I went up there, and I was like, you know what, y'all not messing with me. Yeah, I didn't use those words. Uh, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, <laughs> let, you go on, go on, let me do what I do. Y'all ain't, you know, I ain't messing with me. And when that happened, the first time that I felt it was when we did a show and some of those artists from that label were on the show and the people that I knew that were the reps or yeah. whatever, yeah. they was like, man, we can't work with you, man. We oh. can't, because the label said this and the label said that. And you truly, as an artist, feel naked. You don't, right. because we came up in the era where everything was taken yeah. care of, of, of for us. Yes. And so, like, when that happened, I was like, it's real. Right. It's real. So there's never been another time, there's never been a time where you feel so naked right. in, in, in the business. And I was just looking at um, Unsung, I think it was, mm-hmm. and Moni said the same thing. So he was like, once you do that, like, you Moni don't, love? Yeah, yeah, you don't know where to yeah. go. You don't know yeah. who to talk to. You don't know. It's, it feels like you just got shut out your house. You know what mm. I mean? So... One of the questions you forgot to ask on Quick Time with Slime is major or independent. What, what do you prefer? Wow, um, I still I still uh, prefer the major, but not the three hundred and sixty that comes with the major. Like, okay. and that's just because of the time that I was I was in the business. Right. The independent thing is a great thing, but you have to be a special individual to be independent because you got to be willing to put in that work and put know, up your own money you put up your own money and, yep. and risk it and you know for me I came up during a time where everything was taken care of for you and you know now I'm not trying to start over like that I'm just blessed to be in the position that I'm in to continue to do the things that I'm doing shows TV and all that kind of stuff because of the history right. that I've I've created so and you have a gold independent album right Mm, I have a yeah, go independent album. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was uh, amazing. That's, a man's that's, a man's thoughts. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's, that's last chance. You. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. that's because most people celebrate an uh, independent uh, album at fifty thousand to a hundred thousand. Yeah, they celebrate that because most of even that, less. I mean, you sell thirty thousand independent. Yeah, that's true. That's yeah. a lot of money. But, independent. But what I'm saying is, if you was a, if you was a, a, a platinum artist before, and you went major, it's like. That, that was the numbers from 50,000 to 100,000 you know obviously anything more is, is a plus right. but the fact that you had a chance to do that with gold 500,000 right. that's you was that's really saying I don't know well, that's, that's crazy, crazy. Right, yeah. right right yeah cause I, I was with um uh I forgot the name name because we fell out. I don't even know. I don't want to say the name, mm-hmm. but um, we did a we we did a good good job. So you know, for me to continue on after that was a big situation for me. But I realized like once you get to a certain certain point, mm-hmm. and you've made your statement and and you've done all a lot in the business, you're pretty much on cruise control if you know what you're doing. Right. And I've been on cruise control for. 15 years now right. You know what I mean 10, 10 15 years So um, When people ask me Are you coming out With anything I'll be like Yeah but I'm gonna do it When I need to do it Or I feel it right. You know I'm not gonna do it Just because 
you know, you're saying I should do it. And a lot of my friends and people that are around me don't understand that, but it's not for you to understand. You got to feel it, you know. I remember back in the days where we used to go in the studio, we'd lock it out for two months. Right. We don't do that no more. They don't do that no more. You you're probably spending 200000 doing that. <laughs> yeah. Think about that. Yeah. With the food yeah. budget. It's different. It's and different. Remember, we used to have the rails. <laughs> yes. Yes. It's, it's, it's carry a little dwarf around. You know what I'm saying? Like, we, man, it was just different pounds. back then. <laughs> There's a lot of money back then. A lot of Lots money. A lot of money being wasted back then. We, could, we couldn't punch the in. The fumble department was taking extra the, money. The, yeah, the, the yeah, good yeah, part about the that analog is we learned not to, not to punch in. Right. Like, yeah, it's like these kids right Make now. Make it work. Yeah, they did. They, you, I, could, I could hear when you punched in, kid. Right, yeah. Like, you had to be good. You had to be I always very say, good. I, I always say analog was, was Ella, and, and you picked that I said earlier. Did, yeah. Because, um, and me and EFN have this debate, and mm. I think we were pretty much on the same side, is that because back in the days, if you wanted to do a record with me, or I wanted to do a record with you, I would have to go to D.C., or you would have to come to New York. We would stuff. have to sit in the, together. It was a vibe, it was both, a vibe, right. We both yeah. fill out the vibe, right. you know what I'm saying? And right. depending on how we vibe, that's depending on how great the record will come out. Fact. Do you think that's something that's missing out here? Um, absolutely. Um, in in you saying that, I was one of we were one of the uh, uh, artists during that um, era that had that um, that that had that ability to do that. Nas and me right. when we did that, he was in L. A. I, I wasn't. Oh, yeah, wow. I mean, he was in New York. I was in L. A. Oh wow! Yeah, yeah, I didn't do that. Yeah, we we never even had met until the video shoot. Get the fuck yeah. out of here! Yeah, yeah, yeah. We we wasn't in the same. And it was physically sending the reels in, in the yeah, mail. Yeah, and that was that was the first time. That was not the first time. I'm pretty sure, but that was that era when people didn't have to be what he's or, saying. Or it's, right. or it's actually crossing into digital at that time. Yeah, right. it was right. crossing into yeah. it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So so yeah. I mean, I heard him. He was in the studio. Right. I didn't see him, but he. But I heard he was like, "Gee, what's up?" Da, 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 all that. Oh, you guys were live. Yeah, like because Pharrell talked him. about even yeah. him doing yeah, stuff like yeah. that. Yeah. So 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 we did, you know, I I was in LA and he and he was in New York. You got a shot? Uh, I got to take a shot for that. Come on, let's take a shot. We got to take a shot for that. God damn it. Your shots, we, right? Okay, right. Right, let's go. God damn it. Let's go. Salud. Mm-hmm. Fuck this mama horn a little. This is fucking me up. So what is your favorite part? Is it making the music? Or performing the music. Performing. I could I could tell. <laughs> I knew your answer already. <laughs> you getting panties thrown at him. <laughs> 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 like listen, that shit. Listen, I'm gonna be honest with you. Like I said, when you on that stage, mm-hmm. I see I, I, I see you having so much fun. Oh yeah. But not only that, yes. I see that that's your domain. That's where I'm comfortable at. Yeah, I see that that's your domain. Yeah, that's that's like, where I'm totally comfortable. I was telling my brother, um, and my sister over there, Gussie, mm-hmm. um, uh, we were talking in in the um I can't I can't let y'all know what I'm I'm doing yeah, later no problem, on this no year. But she, they know that I'm, I'm, I'm actually a little like reserved. I don't yeah. like to use shy. You know, yeah, that, oh, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I'm a little reserved, and I never like to come out of my comfort zone. Right. You know what I mean? So, so that stage is your comfort that, zone. That stage is comfort? my comfort zone. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. So right. I can be silly. I can be dumb. Right. I can be serious. Right. All, all things is doable on the stage. Right. You know what I'm saying? But I hate the studio. Mm, wow. I can't. Stay in the studio, no bro. Way. Ty, Ty is like that too, my boy. Okay. Ty, Tyrese, he, he's like that too. Tank, live in there. Right. He, he'll right. live in there. But I can't stand it. The quicker, the, I can't get out quick enough. Who's somebody who make you feel comfortable in the studio? And no What's one, something that make you feel comfortable? In the no one's ever in the studio when I'm in the studio. It's only me and the engineer. Wow. Yeah, I'm not even a producer. I put Tim out. I put. <laughs> Everybody Missy's got. like that too, right? Missy, Missy doesn't like, like to record yeah. anybody. That's how, I'm telling you, that's the, that's your camper. That's, the that's what y'all <laughs> that's the history. Yeah, I don't. You, you can't be in here. I don't. I don't need you to tell me when I'm off. Right. And then I don't like to whole have a whole bunch of people there. And then if I do something, they say, <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that. You know what I, mean? I don't need you to tell. Look, I mean, this records I've done. I, I, I'm good. I don't need you. Right. You here to finish product. That's all I need you to do. Right. Yeah, I don't. I don't like nobody in the right. studio. If you a writer, right? Give me the leave. um. Give give me the uh the track uh whatever the uh. Like vocal, the demo? vocal track, right. yeah, and and get out. Right. Yeah, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> right. But when you come back, you be like, whoa, right. that's what it is with me. Right. Yeah, yeah. Is there ever anybody you ever uh, work with and 
you wanted to work with, got to work with them and was disappointed? No, okay. never. It's pretty much? No, never. Never. Like, yeah, like I haven't worked with too many people. Puff, oh boy, that boy know how to party. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, Nas, <laughs> of course, Timberland, uh, Missy. What about Aaliyah? Uh, uh, Aaliyah, yeah, yeah, that's my baby girl. I love her, miss her dearly. Right. Um, yeah, nah. Yeah. Nah. Nah. Again, because it's not too many people that I will allow in the studio that right. I would work with. Because if it's something that I didn't like I just didn't do it right. you know what I mean so now, now I heard you say that Missy called you one day and said that she had a dream yeah that Aaliyah forgave you yes yes and yes, yes. we were all wondering like Aaliyah what, was, what, was, what did Missy mean that Aaliyah forgave you for not leaving Devante on time no 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 she had nothing to, to do with that. Yeah, remember he said okay. that earlier at yeah. all okay. at okay. all like, like that, that's prior to, to us meeting her Missy Timberland. Or, or was it, the, it wasn't the beef with the. the uncle. It was just me and her. Like during during that time, here's here's what the issue was. Mm. Um, we all was uh, you know like a family. You know, Missy Timberland, uh, her, myself, Magoo, Player, Tweet, all of us. I love how you keep naming all of them. I got I love that. I got I love that. I, got, I love that. I got to. I, I love got that lawyer. I got. Sure. I got to give it. That's the lawyer's hear me. I, I respect that. But but um. Her and I weren't seeing eye to eye. You know what I mean? And I think it had a lot more to do with her loyalty to her uncle uh -huh. than so it had to time? do... Huh? Who you were beefing with at the time? or Yeah, a little bit. Okay, cool. Uh, with her uncle, um, Barry Hankerson, mm -hmm. as um, uh, uh, he was the record head and he was... Uh, the company was my manager. I just decided to leave because of whatever reason. Right. You know what I mean? And so, you know, of course, her loyalty is to her family. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, that's where it pretty much stemmed from. We ain't had no beef or nothing. Yeah. There's a woman. I ain't right. beefing with no course. girl. You know what I mean? But it was just one of those things where our our, our, our time had had, you know, separated. You right. know, and so I always wanted to make sure that we were cool. But, you know, I never got the chance and an opportunity, you know, to explain whatever it was mm -hmm. because they, you know, things that things that was happening, I'm pretty sure she was just being told whatever it was, mm -hmm. the narrative of whatever it was with with me. But um, it was a lot behind that. And um, I think at the end of the day, she understood. Mm -hmm. But Missy came and she told me one time she had a dream that Aaliyah said, don't worry about it, she forgive me. And, and I cried. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Deep. yeah. Took a shot for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God damn. Yep, yep. Going at the shot. Rest in peace, Aaliyah. Yep. Woo! What do you think Aaliyah would be if she was still alive? In this in this oh, in this man. day and time, and I would want her to be on the level where 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 uh, B is. To so my Beyonce, Beyonce, yeah. But you, I mean, you just never you just never know. I know that she was headed toward that direction. Like she was doing the movies, she was yeah. doing. Mm. Of course, she was doing music. She was dancing and all that. So, you know, we just will never know, and that's the bad thing about mm -hmm. it. But I believe she would probably be because her work work ethic was crazy. Right. She would, she would, I mean, she was doing everything, man. So I think, you know, as long as she kept that up and she was believable, of course, in movies and all that kind of stuff. So she had every, every bit of talent that was needed for her to, uh, you know, persevere and continue to move forward in, in that, in that, uh, genre and that, in, in, in that, uh, entertainment field. So who knows, man? Mm -hmm. I think she would have been big. Yeah. I, I would hope she would have yeah. been big. I think so. Yeah, she would have been. Yeah. Let's make some noise for Leah. Got that? Yep. Now, how was it being in the Joanna man? <laughs> <laughs> this guy. <laughs> nothing. Nah, Joanna man, man. It, 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 it was a, a great time and, and a horrible time for me. Oh, wow. Um, because that was first of all, like it was a great time because it was like my first movie, mm. and so I was nervous as hell. So we all remember how and still is like how beautiful and 
and and, and big uh, Vivica Fox mm-hmm. So here's my first movie, and I'm her boyfriend. Mm-hmm. I don't know uh, what to do, how to do it. Right. Uh, I got a kissing scene, mm-hmm. so dude, I'm mm-hmm. nervous as hell. Mm-hmm. And so I'm like, do I stick my tongue out my mouth? Do I do I kiss her for real? Uh, uh, do I? You're not asking anybody this. No, I'm in my head. I'm like, <laughs> okay, how do so I you do just this? because I'm thinking movies. I'm like, make it believable, nigga. Make it believable. Uh, uh, make it believable. So. I said, do I do this? Do I not? Do I? So she came to me, and then I just happened to ask her. I was oh, like, okay. look, I don't know what to do well, you on this. Director. You asked her. No, I asked her. her. I mean, she's asked the one getting killed. Okay, yeah. yes, very true. I was very like, true. I Good don't point. know what to do. Like, I'm nervous. You, Vivica Fox, like, like she and, and she, she was so cool, dog. She uh, made it so easy. She said, kiss me. I said, oh my God. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead. I was like, I'm ready. Okay. But it's still, but even 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 with wanting. Wait, so did you tongue her down then? But, uh, hold on, hold on. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah. But, but even with wanting to 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 to, to, to be with that, yeah. it's still awkward because it's, it's still that, awkward. It's six, seven, eight cameras. It's still so awkward. So it's so how, how did that happen? I, I, I probably fumbled the first time because <laughs> I really didn't. I really didn't know. And everything else, I was, I was cool with. But I was like, okay, you gotta. I think she's with some guy. I forgot the dude. Not fifty cents. Let's leave fifty. Not fifty nine. I think it was a guy named Six Nine or something. Oh, oh. <laughs> I think she was no, not no, 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 no. It was like a guy. So I think that was a. Well, I mean, that's easy. That's, what, that's what, public what, knowledge. But not, um, a, not a gang member though. No, no, no. But you said, well, he was on set. What are you saying? He was on no, set. No, he wasn't on oh, set. Okay, okay. At least I don't think so. I don't know. <laughs> right. But it, it, again, this is my first movie. Right. I don't know. I don't know what, how they do it. Do I, I don't know. You know what I mean? So I, so she was just like, kiss me. And I was like, got gotcha. <laughs> you. And, and how many takes? T- t- yeah. <laughs> t- hey, look, I messed up on five times. <laughs> on purpose. Can't do it again. <laughs> on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, 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 it was great for me, man, um, as far as that first start of it. But on that set, my mom passed. Mm. Oh, yeah, right. so 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 it was it was it was great. Not only, um, uh, what's her name? Uh, Kim Wayans, her brother passed on on. Oh on wow! That. Yeah, and so it, it was one. It was it was it was a crazy set, but we got through it, and everybody was. Um, you know, and it's one of those uh, movies that you got to go back and look at. You know how you... It's a classic. Yeah, it's one of those movies you got to go back and look at. We're like, oh, this was great. This was dope. So, yeah, but yeah, man, it, 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 it was good, and then it was bad right. for me. Uh, and then, it was, that, was that the time you got your love for acting? Or do you have the love for acting way before that? I really never had a love for acting. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I never had a love for acting. So it wasn't then? Before? <laughs> yeah, no, nah, I really didn't have no... I mean, I'm, I'm just now, like, uh, um, opening up to a lot of... I've been in Parks and Recreation. I've been in... I did a couple of movies, Honey and the, 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 uh, Moesha and all that. And, you know, I knew that just came with it. Right. I just wanted the stage... You know what I mean? Oh, All that other came. stuff came with it. Right. I, I didn't. I didn't know about that. You know, what right. I mean? that was it, new to me. Is it because, like, you know, they have you hurry up and wait, like, like that type of shit? Yeah, well, you know, yeah, especially on on movie sets. Yeah, you gotta hurry up it's and like, wait. Hurry up, uh, yeah. hurry up and wait. And I'm impatient a lot of times. So especially back then, I'm just learning a lot of patience. You know, so having seven girls, you uh, you you gonna learn patience. Seven girls. Yeah. So wow. so so I've I, I've learned to have a little more patience. But early on, I had none. Right. Like if you get my food wrong in the, in the drive through, like I just told you the right mm. order. Like why? Like why don't you have the right? Like I was very impatient. Like I had to learn patience. Like early on, you know what I mean. So yeah, because uh, yeah. <laughs> movie sets is real. Yeah, movie, movie sets, sets is real. Absolutely, but you real. did theater. I did, I did, well, yeah, I did plays and stuff like that, man. But you know, that was really one of the things that I wanted to uh, open up as far as uh, going into movies and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Because with plays, it's so dope. Is it one take? 
that's the, there you go. You felt more comfortable uh, on the stage yeah, there. Yeah, with the plays, I was like, this I can do. It's more your you environment. Right. Right. You got to ad lib, like with, with uh, movies and so all that kind of stuff. Sometimes you can't even stutter. Sometimes you can't even say your line twice or something just to get on to the right. next And you got to do different takes and do it the same way. Boom, boom, right. boom. And that's not me. I've, I've never been ABC one, two, three. It's always right. on the whim. Just, I've, I've, I don't practice. I don't do none of that. Be like, I don't have right. practice. Right. What do you mean practice? Yeah, practice. No, no, yeah, practice. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, listen, I, even to this day, I don't practice. Like 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 those um, my singers and dancers and band members they go to sound check. I don't go to sound check. <laughs> <laughs> Sound like somebody I know here. Nah, I'm gonna do that. You said, you said, Sound like somebody I know. Damn. Damn. Yeah, I'm gonna do that, man. Like 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 we gonna wing it. Like we gonna wing it because I think the best things creatively come to you when you winging it. Like right. all the ABC one two three. Like of course if you're doing. Certain things, I guess it calls for it. But right. me as an artist, give me tell me how much time I got. Put the clock right there. But thirty minutes, forty five mm. minutes, I got it. Right. Y'all got the songs. Yeah, you know what song to play. Right. Let's go. And you, 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 you depend on them, not a DJ. Well, I have a DJ. Yeah, 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 yeah. I have a DJ. So you do have the song list. Though. Yeah, okay. Just the song. Just, just the song. Yeah, list. yeah, yeah. So, so let me do. Look at my cues. Boom. Uh, all that. <laughs> do all that. But and you'll so, edit accordingly depending on looking at the time. Right, right. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah. So, so TTG, we never we never get in TT. <laughs> yeah, here we, we go. Never get in TT. Yeah, come. we never get in. Let's take a shot. Let's take a shot before we just warm it up. Oh, let's warm it up. Let's warm it up. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. First off, I know you probably said this story <laughs> other places. Mm-hmm. But for our fans, oh, here we go. Our fans, did Tyrese get to you? No, no. But we had we had Tank. We had Tank. <laughs> oh, Tank get to you. Tank, Tank. But for our fans, mm-hmm. we don't know what happened, right. right? And we can't see why it can't be worked out. Right. So just, just I mean, I probably know. I don't. I don't think I know. But <laughs> our fans, to the fans out there that don't know who, who's probably never heard your side of the story. It's really uh, to tell tell the truth. I don't even know a lot of the stuff that the guys has been saying, but it has never been because of them. Right. It has always been because of me even falling out of love with music for a while. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So yeah. that's just what it what has been. I don't even know how to explain it. I think people form their own opinions when it comes to that, but that is so wrong when you know you truly don't. Uh, talk to one another to find out certain things mm-hmm. but at the end of the day me I've always felt like listen in, if I if I get that love back for that then then I'll do it first of all if I had the love or one, wanted to do an album I'd have done it for myself first mm-hmm. I haven't came out with a CD in, since since TGT or mm-hmm. whatever so it's, it's never been about Ty or, or or Tank you know what I mean or nothing like that it's just I don't never want to cheat my audience mm. ever you know what I mean? If I can't give you 110%, I, I am not going in there. If I don't feel it, I'm not going in there. And sometimes it takes other it takes people uh, a certain amount of time to get in there and get that love and that appreciation for what they're doing and just to want to give their best and have that competitive spirit. Mm-hmm. For a while, I didn't have that competitive spirit anymore. Mm-hmm. So I just did not want to go in there and cheat my audience. It had nothing to do with them. You know what I mean? Nothing to do with But again... What? That's why when you say that, yeah. you never heard that from me mm-hmm. because I'm not fighting you. I'm not going to fight, you know, the people out there to think something or whatever. You know, until you hear it from my mouth, like, right. that's what it's going to be. That's what it is. I'm, not, But no, it's never been for Ty. That's my boy. Right. Tank, that's my boy. Right. You know, it is what it is. But I don't want to cheat them. Right. Right. And most of all, I don't want to cheat the people and, and that support that Avant was supposed to be the original? yeah I, I actually I started the the whole thing the concept right. and of course it wasn't TGT we came up with that as we was working right. but um on a plane uh, a tank yep. I think that way I don't remember I, I don't remember but Ty wasn't even our first my first choice right. it was Avant 
Right. Avant was doing a record Avant was coming out With a record And so he was like I can't uh, You know Whatever And so I was like Come on let's call Ty mm. And so It was um, Formulated Like in 2008 But it never Was brought to fruition Until uh, What 2013 14 Whatever it was So um, Yeah So, but, but once that happened A lot of other things Came in In the play so I was just like, ah, oh, man, okay. The money issue. Mm. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. For and for for me, that is one one of the, that is one of the issues early on. Right. I don't think you get into a group to say that you're better than the group. Like if you're the, if you feel that way, stay yeah, solo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You don't you don't get into a group to say, oh, I'm bigger or whatever. And so that that rubbed me the wrong way. Right. First of all, but I was still like, okay, let's. I let's it took a little convincing, you know what I mean, but I was like, okay, let's let's do this. But it was the second time okay. that the same thing happened because I was already through the first time. Right. And I entertained it the second time. And once that subject in that specific situation came up and it was again that Good. I was like, okay, right, I'm good, so I'm good, dog. I mean, you you can answer this I'm good. Way, whichever way you want. But when you say that he got more money, are we talking about for the upfront advance? No, 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 no. Or no, we no. talking about for show? Yeah, for yeah, show. It, it, it was like a show thing, and um, wow. like the upfront. But then, it, but here's what I presented to presented. You know, the second go around, I was like, okay, we we can do that. But when the bills come in, you pay that same percentage right. that you're getting. It can't be can't be equal. Right. When the bill come in, you know what I mean. Uh, so we gonna keep it funky. We gonna keep it funky. That so hell. so once that was discussed, and I was like, first of all, I'm cool, bro. Right. I'm cool. I don't. Right. I'm cool. I'm comfortable. Right. So I don't need to do it. Right. And and so I've always been a true believer. You know, the things that the way that things start out is the way that things finish. Right. And so with me already being on the edge after the first time. <laughs> Going into the second time, it's being that way. I was like, okay, so we won't fight, so we won't hate each other. I'm fine. I actually even said, get another person. I don't know if Tink even actually told y'all this. Right. I don't know if he told right. us. Yeah, Sonny tried out. Yeah. I, I, said, I, said, I, I said, get another letter. Like, I'm good. Get another, get another letter. I'm another fine. letter. You know what I mean? And so I think, I think that, that's what... You know what? What drove me to the point where like, okay, cool. I'm we still friends. I want to still be, you know, whatever. Yeah, but 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 I'm gonna be honest. It is a classic. Yeah, it is. I love that record. I don't yeah. even listen to my own records, uh, but that CD I listen to. It is I a classic. Absolutely so listen to it. What would it take? Nothing. I can't do it. <laughs> Speaking from his heart. Nah, I'm not gonna do it. My brother hate that. <laughs> He hates it. No, he hates it. No. I, I, but you absolutely I, say never? Never. Never. No, I'm not doing that. Because you before you were saying when you when you're ready. I'm not doing now I'm talking about me. Yeah. I'm not doing that no more. No. Oh wow. Do we take a shot to that or yeah, not? We can. Yeah, all right. I take the shot to never. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Come on, let's go. I got I got a shot right here. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on. Hey, listen. Hey, listen. I, I, no, you gotta take it. Nah, nah. nah you ain't, you gonna sip this one this time. Come on, let's, let's sip this motherfucker. Let's you never go. Can say <laughs> never. But yeah. I'm just saying, right. as right. I said. Yeah, don't say now, never. Yeah, you yeah. never can say never. Again, right. I'm being real with it. Right. Never can say never, but as a way I am now, nah. Right. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Good. Waiting for your shot. <laughs> Maybe the right situation. Yeah, I'm, I'm watching. I'm watching come you up. very closely, sir. Go ahead. Mm. It's not a shot. This is just not. Oh well. Oh, okay. Wow. Yeah. Because if a label came with the right situation, because let, let's suppose that's let's, another situation. And let, let's suppose Wait, this. That's another let's situation that caused a situation. Yes. No. Let's suppose. Wait. Hold this. on. Let them let okay. expand on my that. My bad. My bad. My bad. Go ahead. What's the situation? I don't even know how to explain this though, because it's all it's, it's all got to do with the time. Okay. Back in the day, if we uh, if 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 we didn't do something that we were supposed to do and we contract we contractually obligated ourselves to do, would they give us a pass? But let me let me let me be devil's I'm, I'm just I, I, you're, you're asking about the deals back then. Yeah, I'm, no, they usually I'm, wouldn't give you a pass. This is something. This is food for thought. This. But let me be devil's advocate. You'd be stuck on the label indefinitely no, no, no. if you didn't do it. What you had to do. Mm -hmm. How about mm -hmm. this? Let me be devil's advocate. What if a label came to y'all and said, "I want to buy 
TGT, right? Okay. I want to get TGT, right? Okay. But what and but what the thing is, I'm gonna negotiate with you on the side. I'm gonna negotiate with him on the side. I'm done. No, and then I'm, no, gonna, no, I'm not doing that. No, but what, what if what if that what if that label comes with the number you want? And I uh, fuck um, to get the number. No, no, no. We we if if, if, if you want to split down the middle three ways. Yes. Okay. Yeah. That, okay. <laughs> okay. That's right. nothing to talk about. Okay, what are right. you talking about? No, but what if what if no. the label came and with a number that you liked? I don't give a fuck. No. Because because you, 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 you saying group thing a group. Why? Thing. why? Can you saying it's a possibility that a someone group. else? Okay. Sorry. Yes. If we okay, are in a group. Uh, we are a group Right If you want to be solo Just go solo yeah. Leave me alone yeah. Leave me the fuck alone I understand your point Leave me alone <laughs> you, you can't get in a group Or, or anything to say you're better that, that, right. that, that now turns Turns it into something else Between you and me Yeah You know what I mean Like, uh, like And so that's why I took the higher road And was like Oh uh. I'm, it's not like we started out as a group, and that's right. why I feel for a lot of groups because a lot of times that's what you'll only be known for. Mm. Feel me? We are three kings, mm. solo, mm. separate. Mm. Uh, I, like I the don't double have to like do it. this. You know what I mean? Tank don't have to do this. Mm. Ty don't have to do this. So we did that because we are friends and we felt that it would be something special for the people. Right. Okay. But the inner, inner, you know, stuff, you know, kind of messed a lot of things up. But it wasn't because, you know, I wasn't willing to bend and, you know, try to make things work. I, I did that in the beginning. Mm-hmm. If, 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 if I'd have stuck to my guns, so it right, would have never even been the first joint. Mm. Right now, if someone comes and says, three, 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 split down the middle, there you flying go. y'all to Maui, y- y'all gonna make the record for. There you, you go. You know what I mean? There you go. Three, but three, we three, still gotta talk. But yeah, <laughs> <laughs> we still gotta talk. We still gotta talk. There you go. Never say yeah, never. Yeah, that's what I said. Never say never. never. I, I'm making some noise. I'm, yeah, yeah, I'm yeah, taking yeah, this yeah, shot. Yeah, I'm making yeah, some noise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Take two shots. Take two shots. Jesus. He said, Jesus. 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 And and then you bullshit right there. You know you bullshit. Here, take this too. Look at all of them. Yeah, oh, they just fine. Yeah, 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 that's nice. I keep my evidence right here just in case anybody, you can smell every cup is, is, is. De Leon in there. God damn it. Japanese so, De Leon? Your drink of choice is Hennessy. Yes. So you used to like to fight a lot. Yes. And yeah, we call that <laughs> look at me juice. Had the pretty white yeah, syndrome. Cause, skinny yeah, pretty yeah, white syndrome. Yeah. Any any cause anybody who drink Hennessy in my uh, <laughs> uh, uh, acknowledgement. Yeah. It's a fight. Very aggressive yeah, person. Man. Now you're very laid back. Yeah. Very, you now, got it yeah, together. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm but older. at one point, at one I'm point. Older. Oh, you was wilding was, out? Oh. When you was on tour, yeah. you were drinking Hennessy? Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> like, mm, uh, if it was uh, social media back then, it would be yeah. a little different. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, no tough guy stuff. It was just right. like stupid yeah. young boy stuff. Right. There right. no nothing tough guy or nothing right. like that. But yeah, yeah. I'm glad it was no social media back then. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. What's the, what's like the wildest thing you seen on tour? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, come on. <laughs> you don't gotta be wild. That question. What? <laughs> oh. How about the, 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 the below the wildest okay, thing you've yeah. seen? <laughs> Something. I mean, I mean, I mean, come on, man! Like, the, like the tour, the after parties is is always something that you experience and you just say, "Wow, I never th- thought this was possible." Mm-hmm. Like this is. <laughs> <laughs> right. it's, it's like it's crazy, man. Yeah, when I was younger, man, like, and I can't imagine. Damn, your shows because you some of the shows that we see, was doing was a little crazy. You just see a lot of crazy stuff, like. Mm. Nah, you just see. I, I mean, I, I don't know. Like, I've seen, I've seen you ask so one. Like, that's the craziest thing to happen. Yeah. The same thing has happened to a lot, a lot of artists. When you check in the hotel, right? A girl, some girls or a girl is in your room. Oh wow! Now back in the days, we'd be able to be like, oh, we. Oh. Man, if I'd have thought back then, I'd sue the hotel. I'd do all uh. kinds of stuff. But I'm oh. young. I'm like, you would have owned the hotel. Let's oh, get busy. Let's do this. Oh. <laughs> You smashing your stalker. <laughs> your stalker's coming through you like fuck it. It's crazy. 
the best thing about being a seasoned artist that yeah. made it through all that all that now you now you can see all the hiccups you can see all the craziness that can happen later right. and you try to you know remove yourself from that situation and so like i said like i'm glad it wasn't like a lot of social media around right. that day yeah, uh, uh, in those times because yeah a lot of crazy things happen so, so, crazy. so let me ask you what do you like more <laughs> Uh, being married or being single? I'm not married. I know. I'm just saying. Oh, oh, oh you're saying period. Being married. Like period. In overall life, being married. Being married. Yeah. I heard you say that before. Yeah. You said for a man. Yeah. I thought this was a dope speech. You said for a man, you feel like a man should be married. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I, I I feel like it, it betters us. Yeah. Yeah, you know I mean because it 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 it, it, it limits our. It grounds you. It, it, it kind of buys us, and but. I also feel like, you know, because of how the world is and where we are, you know, we're taught a certain cert, certain way. And so I feel like, yeah, yeah, I think marriage is the best thing for a guy. You know what I mean? Because the only bad things come from you just doing a whole bunch of bullshit. It's true. You know what I mean? Like only only bad things come come from that. And so the crap shoot you know, I'm single. you know, I'm 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 looking for that. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So you still know. believe in love? Absolutely. Absolutely, absolutely. There's nothing like that, especially when you have the kids and every mm-hmm. everything. You know, I was I was speaking to uh, a young fella, and I was just like, man, when I came home, finally, I mean, once the divorce and all that happened, and I came home and the house was empty, I was like, it's real. It's <laughs> wait, empty like no towels, no everything, <laughs> no it's, uh, quiet, so, yeah. quiet, nothing yeah. happening. And I was like, I don't like this. <laughs> I don't like, no one to argue with. I don't like this. <laughs> I don't like this. I mean, you don't you don't miss it until it's gone. You feel me? Right. So um, yeah, I think I think the best thing for a guy is, is is to have that stability in a woman and and kids and a family and just you know just be a family man. It's catching up. It's catching up. Dale que tú puedes, man. Yo, um, right now, I feel like you manage yourself. Absolutely. We need you to explain that to these artists. Yeah. One, that don't think they can do that. Yes. And two, the reason why. As far as me managing and doing a lot of the stuff that I do for me on a daily basis, I think it's uh, it's a great thing for me because I've had so many, well, not so many, two situations in my life that were detriment to uh, me prospering in in this entertainment business, and so like in the beginning, like I had like uh, from ninety six to uh, two thousand one accountant. Like one thing I want to say to a lot of the young young uh, artists out there: pay attention to the accountants and your lawyers. Wear many hats. Don't just say. I'm on the road, I'm doing my thing, and yo, the money gonna be there. Because the same way that you're working, and as hard as you're working, if you get the wrong person to manage that, yeah. manage that they're working just as hard to think of how to, to steal your money. Right. You know what I mean? There's wolves out here, man. And so With you ties on. Yeah. And and stand up. Hey, what's up, dog? And that's actually their business, how they make man. it. Right? They don't even either. This happened to me twice. Accountants or management? Twice. Lawyers? Twice. The accountants. Wow. And so the third time, you know, in two thousand seven, mm-hmm. when the uh housing crisis hit. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. It was a tough time. Bruh, I was asset rich, but money poor. I think I had $48,000 in my account. Wow. I got Rolls Royces. I got Lamborghinis. I got homes. I got all that, but I only got $48,000. Wow. And so 
During that time It was more so about You know The housing And the, I think Bernie Madoff And all that kind of yeah, stuff Yeah it, it was a tough and, time man. And all A lot that. of people Were going through And so I went to the FBI and f- For this person And it was Basically told me We have bigger fish To fry So th- Basically You on your own Kid Again right. For the second time Right So From that point on I just said I'm handling I don't care how Hard the homework is And the work is I'm going to handle it myself And I could not have done Nothing better Than to do that man Mm. Like And so now I'm sitting good I'm comfortable I ain't rich 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 Or whatever But I'm very comfortable Don't need to Sing no more You don't have accountants Don't need Nah I mean I I have Um People who pay taxes. A place, no, nah, no. Nah, I have a place that we reconcile every every quarter. Okay. And this is what you made. Blah, 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 all that. And then I just pay quarterly. Right. You know, because that's what it's truly about. But they have they, no access to your accounts. Access to no right, right. accounts. Yes. Period. Yes. You know, they just advise you on what to, how to they, pay, they, who they, to pay, what to pay. Yeah, and that's what a lot of guys don't understand. A lot of yeah. uh, artists, not just this guys, kind of females, everybody. Um, you got to take control of your life because at the end of the day, no one will care about your life more than you. Mm. So you got to take control of that. And so... You know that's that's what I did in 2010, and so from that on, I don't have no manager, don't want no manager, don't have uh, 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 you know uh, uh, accountants that that uh, have access to your money and all that. I do everything in house. I hire a person that um, you know handles certain situations, but no one has access. To the things that I, you know, I got going, you got ahead. I, I, I got going on. So, yeah, man. Because, but damn, man. If I, if I did knew what I knew now, then, I, man, I'd be in such a better position. But let's make some noise for that. Let's make some noise for that. But, 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 but you being as busy as 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 you be, like you said, I think you said like you, you almost probably do twenty shows a month if you wanted to. Yeah, I'm gone every weekend. Not, not 20, but, right. but I just think Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And you yes. negotiate all of those shows every, yourself? Every show. Yourself. Every, every, as yourself. Every show. Every show. I'm looking at you. Every every show. Right. Yeah. Is it, is it ever an awkward conversation no. with a person? That's what I need. That's what it That's is. It. <laughs> That's it. Very what simple. That's very simple. Right, right. That's honestly. Because uh, you know, you know how I said it because the artists feel awkward. The artists just like, oh, no, I don't want to talk about it at all. You talk about more money. You right. feel me? Like, because it's not a lot of stuff to do that, like, my brother's right there. He'll tell you, like, listen, are you free? Yeah. How much you need? X amount. What do you need on your router? Blah, blah, blah. Send me the contract. That's what it is. Right. It's not a Shouldn't lot to that, bro. Right. Mm-hmm. It's not a lot to that. Now, the manager, it's specifics and all that kind of stuff. And all that, because, believe it or not, a person can put certain things in the contract and be like, oh, he said, blah, blah. but you just got to have a person that can just read it, read it, read it. And I actually sit, I sit through it a lot of them. If I don't, I pass it on to my road manager and we, we, we talk it out. And yeah, yeah. But you have a road manager though. Yeah, yeah. That I helps have you a road manager. You, yeah, because yeah, yeah, you need yeah, that. Yeah. Shout out to T. Yeah. But, Ter- Terrence Williams. All right. Yeah. Damn, that's crazy. That's dope, yeah, man. I don't, so many artists need to hear that. Yeah, that, I don't uh, let nobody mess with my money. Because at one point, um, I, I, I haven't before, but at one point, I had to deal with two situations the same way, way as you. I bet you and did. And I didn't, <laughs> I didn't trust no, nobody. So yeah. I would, but I would be fronting. I would tell, I would not tell people it was me negotiating deals. Nah. I had a whole different email. I had ah, such and such. Good yeah. Stuff. yeah, yeah, I had such good and such. And, and good they were negotiating with me. They just didn't know it was me. Yeah, right. And he you would say, it's Jose Gonzalez. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. Calm down. <laughs> yeah, but I swear to God. So I understand that, that totally. Is that something that like I like to let them know it's me though. But you let them know it's me. Like, it's, it's me, you, bro. Like, it's, like, it's, yeah, yeah. I'm watching. Wine, I'm right. looking. I'm looking. Oh, that's, like that's when you get burned like that twice, man. Hey, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, you don't hey. no 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 time for three. Oh yeah, no time for three. <laughs> did that? Did that? Um, <clears throat> did that make you bitter to a certain extent? Because yeah, absolutely. Because you know what it is. We're giving the people jobs. At the end of the day. With no disrespect to any manager out there or anybody that works behind the scenes, we're still it's still us that's the artist. Yes, we know that they help make us. Right. But we also we're given the opportunity. Mm-hmm. We're given mm-hmm. the opportunity. Mm-hmm. And I just feel like they should honor that. 
it, to a fault. Yeah, to it, a fault. It, it hurt with both times I went through it. Man, that 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 truly hurts when someone that how to, just to just to put things in perspective, you as a person, you just you're looking at a person to guide you and 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 take care of you like your mother or your father. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm. So when that person violates that trust, mm. it's a stain on your heart. It's a stain in your mind. And so it took twice, took two times for me to be like, I don't... All right. All right. <laughs> Fuck you. I, 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 you know what I mean? So that is, it, it's, it's messed up, man. And so I just feel like, you know, when you take on a, 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 a job like that, just have the best in mind for your for your client yeah. because when a lot of people don't understand um, even managers and, and people like that as long as you make that one person successful so many yeah. other people other, yeah. are going to come to you yeah just do right yeah just do right I respect that just do right and so a lot of people don't don't understand that it's like it's, it's just like that story about the goose with the golden egg they, uh, the fox came out there and killed the uh, killed the uh, uh, the goose and thought it was at a billion eggs yeah. what come on man you got to un- enjoy and understand the process of making that situation a situation right. and building from that situation right. a lot of people don't understand that they just in there for the quick money you shouldn't right. do that Right. You enjoy the process. Enjoy, enjoy, always being around the element of you uh, 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 being able to move forward. You know what I mean? And that's why I've always said I don't have to be number one. I don't have to be on the charts. I don't. Have, but am I in? Am I in the room? Mm. That person going. Oh, I remember Pony. Mm. Oh, I remember this. I, yo, can you do this? Can you do this? That's how you continue to go like this. That's how you continue to build, build, build. The person that I'm too good to talk to anybody. Nah, you, yo, you need me. You need that. That's not. That's not the person that's going to prosper. Right. Mm. When he or she falls, they're going to fall like this. Mm. When the person that has made those connections, made those, you know, friendships, they're going to go like this. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Because of the people that are in the room. Mm. Right. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So that's what you're supposed to do. You always maintain your humbleness. You always maintain and understand that nothing lasts forever. Mm. Always know that you can be here mm-hmm. or you can be there. Yeah, do right by people. You right. got to do right by people, bro. Because they might be at one right point in a different there. position. You know what I mean? You got your shot ready? Yes. Come on, come on. Shot yeah. yeah. machine, bro. I'm here. Let's go. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. <laughs> that was too. so. In those jeans. <laughs> he wants to know what's Why in those jeans. <laughs> in those jeans. <laughs> in those jeans. I gotta make sure this is right here. Right there, bro. <laughs> How many times you get tagged on Instagram a day? A million. Where, where people just showing you in they jeans. Uh, uh, a lot. And did you make in them jeans while you had on a pair of jeans? I didn't make those jeans while I had on a pair of jeans. But <laughs> let me give you a story. Okay, let's go. Let me give you a story. I'm in. Uh, I don't know if I said it. Go oh, ahead, you can say it. Nobody listen to us. I can say it? Okay. Yeah, you can say it. So I did a song called Hell Yeah. Mm-hmm. R. Kelly wrote that song. Let's big up R. Kelly. Yeah. All right. Hey, okay, now I'm comfortable. Now I'm comfortable. Yeah. All right, cool. cool. Now, <laughs> now I'm comfortable. Go ahead. Now I'm go comfortable. Ahead. Go ahead. Oh, stretch, stretch, stretch. <laughs> oh. So, and, and that's two stories. Okay. So, um, he wrote that song for me, right? And I was like, oh, that's dope. Boom, boom, boom. And then he, um, uh, so fresh, so clean, so shiny on the thing. Girl, you saw me. Why you doing mm. the damn thing? You need more room for me in those jeans. I said, What? <laughs> oh, he made his own version. In those jeans. 
I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna take that. Mm. And I wrote a song about it. Mm. I wrote I wrote that song from that song, from that piece, right? And so when I wrote that song, I was like, yo. Kelly didn't like it though, for real. <laughs> he didn't he, he like it. He didn't like it. But I wrote what that. What did he song. call you and say, you pretty boy? Oh, no, no, he ain't no. <laughs> pretty, you pretty nah, nigga. Nah, he, he, did, he tried to do the New Jack City nah, scene on that. you. No, he Come on, let me tell you. Talk about it. Talk about it. He didn't do that. What, what happened? Well, well, he called the label. He called. Oh, so, <laughs> he called the label. <laughs> oh, that was. <laughs> oh. He called the label. He okay, called he called the label. He said what? That's the homie there. Yeah, that's the homie. So, um, you know, he, I, I, of course, you know, it was a little static in the, in the beginning, but you know, the label was like, nah, this a hit. I don't, I don't care what you're talking about. And so, and so, so we came, came out with it. So, you know, shout out to Ah man. Um, but yeah, one uh, uh, in those jeans was one of those songs for me, man. I was just like, I was just being creative. Mm. I was just being a creative dude. Mm. You know what I mean? And so, again, I was in Miami. I think it was uh, Fat Joe, uh, Ja Rule. Okay, all of us was. You know, we were in the same. Uh, uh, it's in those jeans. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah, we was in the same uh, vicinity. Uh, oh, yeah, it was Miami. a level was, nightclub yeah, and shit. Yeah, we, we, we was doing our thing. But um, yeah, it was it was it was great, man. It was great. In great those experience. jeans, it, great experience in those jeans, man. I said, <laughs> listen, I'm I'm just like. Uh, what was that line? JC uh, said, "You made it a hot line. I made it a hot song." Mm. <laughs> that, At that time, he was going there. That's Kelly. what I was. Oh, a little bit, just, yeah, just a little just bit. He made me mad. He made yeah, me mad because he called my label. Like, you made me mad. He made me mad. He, he called your label and said, "Can't wine out here." That wow. can't. That can't go out. And the label was like, "Yes, it can. Right. <laughs> it's can. Wow. So it's all good." <laughs> that was a good. Giving you jewels. I'm giving you jewels. So okay. um. I know I'm bouncing around. Yeah, yeah. do it, do it, but, do it. Uh, two reasons I cry. Ooh, come on, man! Don't do I that. I have a don't record do that. sometimes. Okay, about it's a my great father record. Passing away. Oh, wow. Who? About my father passing. Yeah. Away. Okay. Amazing. Got you. Got you. And man. I don't listen to it. Yeah. Me. So when I I was like, what? And I, I was like, of course I listened to it as I made it. Of course, of course, of course. Of course. We had to listen back. Of course. But physically, like sometimes people will will put like, you know, I'll jump in a a, a car service somewhere and they'll be like, oh shit, and they'll put on a playlist. And as soon as that record come on, I'm like, yo, no disrespect, can you push that? Forward? Yeah, push that. Because for me, I didn't. I made the record to vent. But I ain't make the record for me. I made the record for it's, everyone else going through. It was therapeutic. What, it was therapeutic. Yeah. I made the record for everyone else that was going through it. Yeah. And when I heard you say that same story, I was like, I was like, man, <laughs> he don't even, right we here. don't even like, we don't even know. <laughs> and that's crazy. So have you listened to it? Uh, I, I mean, I have, but yeah, maybe twice in okay, on purpose or 50? it was just probably planned. I've never, I've never actually put it on and just listened to it, the whole okay. thing. Nah, it's always been little pieces right. and all that kind of stuff. So, so nah, I've 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 never done that. I've never right. done that because it's too emotional. Yeah, you know, a lot of people that haven't experienced the, the things that we've experienced right. in writing those type type of songs, they right. won't understand the. They won't understand that. You know what I mean? So if I actually listen to that, I can't even function no more. Like like you said, your engineer left out. Oh yeah. My, my, engineer, my, yo, my engineer left out. My too. engineer and um uh Corey Rooney. Corey Rooney, holy shit. He left out. Right. He left he needed out. a moment. Yeah, they needed a moment. Static. Who engineered that? Was Easy LP engineering? Uh, I don't even remember. I don't even no, remember. No, no, Easy LP. Which, he or, produced or it. Yeah, he produced Easy it. Easy LP did, he produced it. I don't think Easy LP was there. It was Kev Kai's. Uh, actually. Um, they left out. Yeah. They left wow. out. Yeah. My, my, my so actually, it was we heavy. had to. Um, yeah, we, we had to take a moment. Right. Uh, yeah, everybody had to take a moment. Because uh, right. they heard it in my voice. I was cracking. Right. And I was and I'm crying and all that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. It was therapeutic, though. You know what I mean? I had to get that out. That actually helped me. Right. Because right. you went through that back to back. Your father, then your, your, your Well, my mama. I mean, my father, mama. then my mama. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. And would both of y'all think that that record would help other people going That's the only reason why I did it. I, That's I the, why you the, did it. Like, you know, I, I did I, the same I actually thing. probably didn't do it for me. I did it for anybody I that did. was going through it. So I'm well, sorry. well. 
In fact, I did it for me and 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 the people. But I had to let it out, bro. Mm-hmm. Like I was hurting, bro. Because I could tell you don't address everything. Well, I was you don't, hurting, you don't want bro. To yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm 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 one of those guys. I keep everything to myself. Yeah, but yeah. but that's why because I, I also read that you went to therapy. Yeah, was absolutely. was therapy help, helping you go that? And, and then I also read that you're talking about depression, right? Oh, oh well, yeah. For for that, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um. I still, I still, uh, I still battle with that though. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, never a lot of people. Over. You know what? <clears throat> what's funny is like you can have all this, all yeah. that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yep. People don't know when you go home, yeah. you be like, yeah. Like a lot of people don't know that, and so I battle with that on a constant basis, on a daily basis. So, um, but you know, at the end of the day, I'm, I'm, I'm constantly moving forward and that's what's most important. Don't allow that to dictate uh, what your movements and what your prosperity will be. Fight for it. Yeah. Move for it. Fight through it. Love. Keep going. You know what I mean? Because that's what it is. Life is a journey. Life is a fight. You can't, you know, I mean, it is what it is, you know, and you know what I've always, um, Find healing in to see things that other people are going through, and I'm like, why are you complaining? Mm. I just posted something. I was, just, right. I, uh, it was uh, a young guy uh, giving uh, um, someone in Africa like bread. And I was like, wow. I'm I'm worried about. It 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 doesn't mean that your feelings don't have any merit or. Yeah, you know, or anything like that. Mm-hmm. But understand that this puts it in going perspective way yeah. more than you are yeah. going through, and that's what I find strength in. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So, so I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't sleep in. You know, my faults or my, you know, all all the other stuff that comes with me being me and all that kind of stuff. I I find strength to move forward. In what others don't have, right. you know what I mean? Because that's where your strength comes. You know what I mean? Right. And so, uh, that's that's what builds me up. That's what makes me who I who, who I am, the man that I am. You know what I mean? Because everything that I be like, oh, oh, I can't, <laughs> I can't, mm. I can't do this or do that. And I'm like, damn, it's they are living on the street. You got a mansion to go home to. What? Right. Shut up! Right. Shut the fuck up! Right, right. Up. Work, work. Up. That's what you got to do. You got to work, and I'm a worker, dog. I, I I posted something um a few days ago. I was like, look, because <laughs> this guy he was supposed to uh, uh, clean my fountain, <laughs> you know, like, okay. and I know how to clean my fountain. Okay. I was like, you know what? Don't clean it. I'll clean it myself. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So we got to. Okay, we're not going to skip over the fountain. Fact, you got a fountain. I got a fountain. A fountain. I got okay. a big fountain. Okay. okay. You got a big, a big fountain. fountain. Because I don't think most of us can relate to having a fountain. <laughs> Everybody's like, "What the fuck is a fountain?" So I'm like, so "Clean it fountain? yourself. Just okay. clean it yourself." Mm-hmm. And so I did that, and I found purpose. I found, I found, like, like, like love. You felt good cleaning. The I fountain, found, right. yeah, like so, so, yeah. So that's so that's what it was, man. I, I'm always appreciative and I'm always thankful for any and everything that's been given to me, and I'm gonna just move forward. You know what I mean? Mm. I don't have I, I I I don't hate, dislike, or nothing nothing like that. I just want to move forward. All right. Ooh, that's that good shit. Yeah. Cool. All right. That's, that's your. <laughs> and you don't smoke weed, right? Shit, y'all. And you don't smoke weed? Nah, man. I don't smoke weed. Mm-hmm. Why not? What made you not want to say? Let me let me hit the let me hit the the, the yonder. You ready for the story? Uh huh. Don't tell the me story you weed and it fucked you up one night and it never turned me back. Don't say that. Five times, six times. <laughs> all right, all right. Yeah. All right. Let's get. Let's get. This is one of the things that a lot of people don't understand. Like certain things aren't for certain, certain people. people. Right. There you go. You finished my sentence, family. So I used to throw up every. Well, not used to. I still will throw up every time I smoke weed. Mm. Anybody oh, in here that smokes weed be like, the weed don't make you throw up? Yes, it does. It makes me throw up. You don't think it's your anxiety? Nah, nah. Because when I smoke weed, I, I be well. When I have smoked weed, I be like, yo, I'm comfortable. And then all of a sudden, my stomach says. 
Not so comfortable. <laughs> it's coming up, nigga. Mm-hmm. Coming up. So you know, it is what it is. Like, some certain things ain't, ain't for everybody. Now that henny, we can do that all day. <laughs> we can Let's do give that. him another shot. Of yeah, 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 we can do that all day. Give him henny and Coca Cola. Give him another shot. We can do that all day. Yeah. We can do that all day. Yeah, yeah. I can't believe. Yeah, we do that. That's all your day. favorite drink. Yeah, we do that all day. Okay? Yeah. All day. You've been yeah, with henny for a long time. That's we it. Do that all day. Yep. Uh, uh, nothing else. Nothing. You know, else. champagne. You never, never. Yeah, of course. All, I've the, done all, that. all the albums you sold. You I've mean? done. That. I've done that, King. Yeah, I've yeah. done that. I've done all of that. But uh, no wine. My drink France. of choice. You know, I did, uh, yeah. did a song like that. Drink of choice. Yeah. <laughs> so that's, you, you, that's you mean to it. tell me you in Abu Dhabi and you like give me Henderson <laughs> Abu Dhabi? I, I, I might. Maybe I bring my own. <laughs> <laughs> that's a dry country. <laughs> Yeah. They'll bring my own. Actually, you talk about the uh, 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 the Hennessy deal is secure. Uh, right away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're, you're, you're killing it. Know. You're killing it. They already the Hennessy know. Deal they is already secure. know. They yeah. already know. Mm-hmm. They already know. Yeah. And we tried to convince you to drink Duce. Nah, 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 nah. We was nah, like, yo, nah. Duce, deal with them. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, 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 Mr. Lee, you tried? <laughs> yeah, we tried. We was like, you was like, it's all love. Salute to do. It's like, it's kind of. He's like, I like Jay Z, but I'm sticking with that. I mean, I mean, you got. I mean, you. Do a shot, just a shot. Uh, of I'm gonna do, oh. I'm gonna do a shot, a deli. That's what I drink. I drink jelly on. Okay. What I drink. You want to take a shot of my mom? I want to do a shot of which y'all drink. Okay. Yeah, you can drink a shot of my mom. Just a shot. Okay. Just a shot. Okay. okay. Marijuana. What? No, my mom. Ma- ma- <laughs> Listen. You ready for the shot here? Oh, you know, no, I'm fucking with that. It's that looks like, yeah. like that looks some yo. oil. You want me to tell you the truth? Genuine. Genuine. You want me to tell you the truth? Listen. Listen. Let me tell you the truth. Let me tell you the truth. They make that in the bathtub. I'm just telling you, in the bathtub. Give it a try. I'll give it a smell it. I'll smell it. I'll smell it. It's got a sweet tint to it. No. Give it a shot. No. It's like Hennessy. Uh, no, you want to try my shot? You want to try my I'll shot? I'll do the, I'll do the no, 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 no. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. No, no, I'm drinking De Leon, That's but it's, oil, it's Japanese De Leon. That shit. <laughs> no. Like Fuck no. Yeah, it's, yeah. Dominic, it's Dominic. It's exactly. Dominic. No, 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 no. no Where's Jamie no. go? Tell him to bring him this Japanese. Give me some Henny. No. Yeah, we do that. We yeah. do that. Yeah. We do that. Okay, this is... Okay, this now what is, is this? This is the Japanese De Leon. <laughs> that Japanese shit be... Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that Japanese <laughs> shit. Hurry up, nigga. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Well, you back out of it. That's, that's Japanese in Little Haiti, though. Stalo. <laughs> mm-hmm. Wow. And look how many wow. shots. Genuine, just so you know. Look how many shots. Wow. Yeah. Oof. We, we having fun. We've been wanting you on this show for so long. Damn, okay. Oh, great. That was so fast. Let me, you know how I play. <laughs> No, you want another, want another shot of Henny just on deck? Okay, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have a shot of that. I think I got it right here. Too. Is this it? Yeah, 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 just yeah. on deck, just because, yep. man, we've been wanting you on the show for so long, my brother. Yes, you thank you, King. It's the early, yes, man. the beginning, man. You Can I truly, tell you something, bro? Mm-hmm. I want to thank you, man. What? Like because when you when you started your podcast, it was like everybody was just like what? trying to, and this was uh, this was like the pandemic and all that. Right. Everybody was just trying to get people on, what? but I was like, he had a purpose. Y'all had a purpose. Y'all had a purpose. It was like, yo, want to give you flowers and yeah. boom, boom for yeah. a lot of the artists that's been what? that's been out, yep. and that's one of the only reasons yeah. you got to under. I got to shout out uh, uh, my singer Delrick Ford Red. Okay, uh, Ricky. Rush, um, all of them because they was like they've been talking about y'all. Uh, shout like, out to them, man. Get in, get up. Nah. And, 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 and thank you for bigging, bigging us up, but <laughs> yeah. I gotta tell you, this is your day, man. Nah, yeah. It's about it. you. This is Appreciate genuine. You. Appreciate you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's a national holiday. <laughs> you understand? It's a national holiday. Where we drink yeah, Deli on yeah, baby. Ace of Spade yes, And we sir. breaking up And Mama Wanna And Mama Wanna Yeah Mama Wanna too no. Mama Wanna too Well um Yeah man Because That's the oil I don't know what he that is I, I, I might taste it after I leave yeah, he, 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 no, no, Keep it right there I'm gonna take it after I leave I'm taking it after uh, I leave Nori's at right yeah, there yeah, and, and, and you never did a verse Yes yeah, yeah. You never did a verse Nah I'm like, never gonna do that You never gonna do that never. Because nobody can fuck with you No Absolutely No Stop it so no. I'm just asking No well, that's why you're not doing the verses. No. Spread the rumor. No. Genuine said he ain't doing the no. verses because nobody can no. fuck with you. No, spread no, the rumor. No, no. I'm sorry. No, no. It's, it's again one of those things where I'm 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 totally this. That's not my thing, man. Mm. It's, it's like I've heard. Um, 
Jay, um, couple, and I'm not on that level. Well, but I nobody can can't stand on stage. I, with I can it, understand you going what they're talking about. Like I don't, I don't want to do that. Like I just, no, it's not that stand. <laughs> See, you started my shit. Bad. You started <laughs> shit. No, <laughs> no. To me, to me, no. it seems sounds like you said no. No, no one not. can I'm stand on that stage agree. with me. I'm not gonna let you yeah, go. Listen, listen, I don't know. No, I don't, I just, that's what it sounds like I to just, me. Don't, sound like that, you're saying that, that no I'm one very, can stand on that stage with you. I'm very entertained by by that. I just don't want to be a part of it. I don't even know uh-huh. why. Like I just don't like want to do celebration. that. celebration. I get it, but right. no, I'll be there. But I, nah, I'm not. Gonna, <laughs> right, right. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. I'm not. I'm, and I'm, money doesn't make a difference. None of that. No. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. You do it. There you go. Let's suppose. Let's but, suppose the money came right, and they asked you. He changes the manage, oh. his management self. Yeah, because your no, management. No, no. We gotta yeah. talk to. Because uh, I gotta talk to two different people now. I gotta talk to the artist in your mind, and the manager in your mind. The manager said, and the manager, well, now, manager right. said yes. Artist said, "I'm, I'm artist." The manager said, "Let me the talk manager to The manager said, "Wait a minute." So look. So look. What happens if the right amount of money comes, <laughs> and then they say to you, "We'll pick your opponent where y'all can celebrate each other's life." What? What? Who would be that opponent that you would pick? It's your choice. I, I, I'm now you starting shit. No, no, no. no. I, I don't. Don't tell don't me know. Tyrese. You just, you just let him know you can't. You can't come out with, ah, with you. Don't tell I me that. I, I really don't know. That's just like, uh, like you, you, you've always. Sometimes, like, if you're interested in something that like, you just want to observe it and you right. see it, but you not w- want to try to kind of be a part of it, like, that's what that is, like, for I me. Like, I, li- I like to see it. Yeah. I like right. to watch basketball. Yeah, I just not don't. Really yeah, I'm not yeah. trying to play jump yeah. the ball. Like, I, that's what it is with me. You know what I mean? I, I, you know, anything, everything has its price. Yeah. <laughs> because you're doing it just because it's something to do, but. Right. I don't really I have no interest in that Right You know what I mean I, I, But I will observe it I'll look I'll say I'll enjoy it And all that But I don't really I don't really look, have but it's cause your catalog Is so crazy. I know I know I know That's what keep, everybody keeps saying I just don't want to do it So has, has Swiss and Timberland Called you? I'm sure Timberland Yeah uh, uh, Associates has, has called me Yeah uh-huh. But I like, No No And what they were saying Who they, who they wanted you against? I don't even listen to it uh, yeah. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she said. It's just, it's just real. I don't, I don't want to do it. I don't right. want to do it. Yeah. I've always been that kind of guy. Like, if, if I've never been the kind of guy to get a car or right. clothes or something because everyone else has it. Right. I've always been the person that if I get it, it's because I actually like it. Mm. Right. Never been a follower. Mm. Always been a leader. Mm. Always. But the manager is also saying, if if the money is right, uh, we'll we'll formulate it into yes. the way that you need it to be, right. and that's and that's why I'm glad I'm a manager and an artist. Does do, do the manager part and your artist part argue? <laughs> 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 if I you know the situation, because <laughs> the artist said no immediately. The man is like, "Well, maybe." Oh, my bad. That's right. That's so, a yeah, absolutely. We argue all the time. We're like, no, you shut up. We're like, no, nah, man. But listen, uh, no. Trust me. Yeah. yeah. Trust it, it happens. It happens. It happens, oh, man. <laughs> that is some funny shit, man. That is a so what? <laughs> What's left, man? You conquered theater. We are, let's let's talk about the reality show. Um, mm. he was the oh, first, here we go, here we go. He was the first guy on <laughs> that I knew on Big Brother. Big Brother, yeah. Bro, you went overseas. Yeah, yeah, they yeah. They took your phone, all that. They take everything. Yeah. They take everything. Wait, what else you brought with outside your phone? I was like, no, no well, your phone is you. We, okay. We're cyborgs. Yes, I told yes, you that. Yes, yes. You know what I mean? But. You know that's an extension of us. So once you take the uh, the phone from yeah. us, and you take the radio, and you take all the outside uh, uh, situations that's happening. Now you only have us. You remember we was like, "Yo, take all that stuff away. How can we uh, uh, exist or whatever?" You would be surprised mm. now that we still have a lot of the stuff that's in us to just 
exists. You know what I mean? It, 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 yeah. it, it happens. But we are so dependent on this. We're so dependent on this. Right. And so we're losing. You go with, through withdrawal, I'm sure. Man, we're losing so much depth in who we are as individuals and just humans, period. Um, we don't talk to each other. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, when I take my kids out, if, I tell them, give me your phones. Mm. Give me your phones. Wow. Put them right there. You know what I mean? Talk to me. Wow. You know what I mean? Because if you don't do that, man, how can you how can you know about someone? How can you know about your seed? How can you know about the person that you love the the most? Mm-hmm. So, um, yeah, man, when we were over there, I was like in a different world, bro. Did you feel like you was like one of the first people that tried that they tried to cancel at first because that was like yeah with the with, 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 with the, the yeah, yeah 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 but. I didn't know it. She tried to kiss you without your permission. I didn't know it yeah. until I got off of it. Yeah, because you ain't have your phone. Yeah, and yeah. so I look. So it's live. As y'all film it, it's live. Everything it, is live. They got cameras everywhere. Don't like, know what I mean by because don't they edit and then send it to the world? Of course. Okay. Of course. Of course. But, um, but you don't know what they're editing. Yeah. So, I don't so, know. So that episode came out. While I was still While there. While you was there, so you, you had yeah, no idea what was happening. no idea. And I almost made it to the end. Right. Well, what happened? Because I don't know what you're talking about. So a when a transgender uh, person. A, a person um, yeah. uh, jokingly. It was right. like, give me a kiss. And I was like, oh, what are you doing? Right. And it wasn't, a, you know, it was what it was. But I, I was just like, I didn't know the effect that it would have right. on me just saying, all of a sudden, I'm... You're anti oh, something. Yeah, right, I was right, like, right, what right. the hell? What, what are you talking about? But one thing that I could always say that most people understood the situation and understood where where it was, and it wasn't... It didn't, it didn't gain legs. Right. Because they already knew... Because it was... Yeah. It, 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 it was what it was. So, um, I, but I was just surprised once I got out. I was just like, what? <laughs> what happened? Because I was hearing, um, I won't say no names, but big um, uh, radio guys was like, he should have shoot, sued them. He should have did this. He should have did that. And I was like, nah, I ain't with all that. You know what I mean? Right. No, I did what I did. Whoa, boom, I'm whatever. Nah, what, move, right. move forward. It wasn't you know? that serious for you in that moment you did what you did? Because yeah, it, it is what it is. It's never right. that serious with me, bro. I'm never. Like, I'm like, all right, boom, this is what it is. Move forward. You know what right. I mean? That's real. When you got the kids that I have, man, grandkids that you have, you yeah. see things in a different light. Yeah. And so you put it in perspective. You don't act always on the things that, you know, uh, constitute you acting sometimes as a younger individual. Right. The way that I did it then probably wouldn't have been the way that I did it in twenty five at twenty five. You feel me? So you know, and, and and that's what's most important. With age comes wisdom, and so you grow. You learn, you move forward, and 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 you set a, a precedent and an example for other people to build on, and then now they have something to look look at and just you know uh, do whatever it is that they need to do moving forward. Right, and everybody grows. That's yeah. the, that's the thing that's crazy about today that everything is filmed, everything is everybody's filming themselves. But this is crazy. Was a reality. No, show I know, that. but I'm but it I'm saying crazy. even, even that, like you, cameras everywhere. Like you can't grow from that because everybody keeps going back to that. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. That's yeah, the yeah. problem of where we at today. Mm-hmm. You know, as humans, we grow, you mature, you right. learn, right. you experience, right. and you change. Facts. And facts. now they keep bringing. Be- no, no, you you are this person when you was this age or this age or this yeah. age. Yeah, and that's not fair. That's so important man like because you can't I even look at a lot of the things that's going on sometimes in the basketball situation boxing situation and all that you know I love boxing and all that right and then I look at you know certain individuals in boxing I'm like you can't give a certain individual a certain amount of money and expect them to do what a 50 year old right. do right. you gotta understand what you're dealing with you know right. what I'm saying so yes wrong right indifferent you gotta understand what what it is, so you can't um, you can't uh, just 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 beat that individual down and thinking that he's supposed to be that person or she's supposed to be that person when there's so much put in their lap at a young age and right. and, and an early early age, and it's not to give them uh, him or her 
uh, a pass, but understand what you're dealing with. You know, it's it, it, it's not fair, really. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's truly not fair. So, All right. yeah, yeah. Would you do uh, Big Brother again? No, no, hmm. nah. Because <laughs> of that, because of that lesson learned, ah, yeah. or just in general, I'm you an just passed that. As I always felt like, man, once you do something and you have success at it, it's a wrap. And you've right. done it, and 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 you've conquered whatever it is, you, you move forward. It's behind you, right? Yeah. How right. about theater? Would you do theater again? Yeah. 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 Because that I think a bad that's, experience. Yeah, I think I think that um, they, I think that sharpens you. I think that sharpens you and that conti- uh, allows you to continue on your path to just be great and just to move forward in uh, other situations, man. I think I, I think theater is great because you have no chance to do it over. Mm. And when you do it there, that's what it is. Right. And if you get stuck or caught up, even you know, like anything that we do, we can slice, dice, but on theater when there's a million people, well not a million people, you know, thousands of people out there and you're on the stage, you got to get through it. Right. That's what sharpens you. Right. That's what sharpens you. So even if you make a mistake, you just got to keep going. You got to keep going. It's not, it's not like, yo, get, let me do that over. You can't, keep, you can't yeah. say, oh, yo, bro, it's a thousand uh, people out there. What are you uh, talking about? Uh, you you got to keep, keep going. And they don't know you made a mistake they, unless they've they seen the show they, before. Okay. There you go. Oh, that's there great. There you go. Yeah. There you go. You got to move. You got to move. You got to move forward. And that sharpens you. Mm. That... Uh, Long as you have that in your mind that you cannot say, mm. cut, let's just do it over. Oh, I'm sorry, but that sharpens you. It's, it, 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 as long as you have that crutch to say, cut, mm. that ain't sharpening you. Right. That ain't sharpening you. Like when you don't have that, you got to continue. You got to think on your feet. You got to mm. move forward. That's what sharpens you. Right. Yeah. Now, um, I just want to touch, this, touch on this lightly because, like I said, um, you said you said you've been in the game for 27 years. Yeah, I've been in 25, I believe. Yeah, and I've seen you all over the world. And like I said, yeah. I have never seen you depressed personally. Oh yeah, I've, I've always seen you uh, like a happy person. We always seen yeah. each other, gave each other love. Yeah. And when I read that you you dealt with depression. I didn't understand why, but then I read it deeper, and it was about the, your parents and how the, the, um, it, it, it came back to back. Now, and then I also read that it was a pastor yeah. that actually helped you with that. You want to talk about that process? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I, I attended um, From the Heart Church Ministries. I got saved in 2005. And so, um, needless to say, like my dad committed suicide, shot himself in the head, oh, 99. And then my mom died the next year, 2000, right? Mm. So needless to say, come on, man. Like, you're going to go through whatever it is. How much? Absolutely. Whatever it is that you're going to happen, whatever, you're going to go through that. And so for me, again, I always use the word therapeutic. Music was therapeutic, you know what I mean? And I was able to navigate my way through life, through music, and to just, just try to find my way. And, um, you know, in 2005, you know, my my then wife, now ex-wife, still great friends and all that. Um, I used to, uh, shit, they used to go to church all the time. <laughs> I used, <laughs> like, they used to go to church and my uh, makeup for not going to church, I used to buy them flowers every Sunday when they go to church. Oh, you so buy them flowers? So, oh, yeah. so when they, so when they go to church, mm-hmm. I go to the store, I buy them flowers, my daughters and all them, and when they come back, I got them flowers and all that. But one day, <laughs> one day, one day, I sound like Sonny would do that. Yeah, one day I just say, yeah, I don't know what is church stuff about. This is that therapy at first. Yeah, I was I was doing what I do, and then I was like, well, okay, let me let me um let me go through this, and so um I kept going, and then the one thing about church and you know the people that are in church, uh you know. Uh, uh, pastors and all that kind of stuff That day It makes you feel very happy It makes you feel very It gives you a reset Gives you like Oh man Okay I can do this I can do that And so there was just one Sunday That you know I felt m- Moved mm. To go To the uh, You know uh, uh, The front And just get saved 
Mm. And so from that point on, of course, I made friends and all that kind of stuff. And there was one guy, uh, 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 Porter Lawson, um, a minister, uh, Lawson, and we became great, great friends. And he just talked talked me through it. He was a, he was an older cat, and he just talked me through it. And I, you know, I thank God for him. You know what I mean? Because he, he he's a good cat. He's still doing what he's doing right now, and he's the perfect example of what uh, you know uh, upstanding you know man should should be. You know what I mean? And so um, I've never seen any fault in him. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So if you're gonna fall, not not fall. If you're gonna follow, I mean, if you're gonna follow somebody. You got to follow somebody that's been been the example of what you you're striving to be. Mm. And so. When I saw him and what he continued to do, because I was always apprehensible about anybody. I'm like, ah, oh, all y'all money, oh, uh, you're lying, and all that. I like politicians. Uh. So, <laughs> so, so when I saw that, I was like, this is somebody I can at least listen to. Mm. You know what I mean? So, um, you know, in my mind, he proved himself. And so I continued to listen to him and I, I still talk to him to, to this day. You felt like he helped you out more than therapy? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Because Therapy when you, is trying to medicate you? Because when you're talking to somebody that's went through the same thing mm. that you've went through. Mm. Good point. To relate. Jail, all the kind of craziness and just yeah. all kind of stuff that he's been through. Man, I ain't been through all the kind of stuff you did. But if you can change, right. ooh, I know I can change. Mm-hmm. So that's what was, was major for me, man. Right. That That's what was major. You know, was uh, another thing that I, I noticed was um, you co-signing your ex-wife's new relationship. Absolutely. Yeah. Ab- Professor Griff, right? Uh, Professor Griff. Professor homie. Griff. From Public Enemy? That's the yeah. Homie. Yeah. yeah. Homie. Oh, that's dope. Homie. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think at the end of the day, as an example, as a parent, period, as a, as a man, if you have kids, you want to extend that to your kids. Why do we have to go to court? Mm-hmm. Why do we have to? Chill, chill. Why? You've been to court. Look. But he's right, though. He's right. <laughs> Not as long as you do it. But now even his kids and he's going to court. Oh, wow. Yeah, that, that's extra fucked up. That's extra fucked up. He's going to court for stepkids. That, that's extra fucked up. That's extra fucked up. And, and, and that's what I'm saying. Like, for us, like, it's a generational thing. Right. Listen to me. Let me tell you something. Mm-hmm. How many, like, like in my time, like we had family reunions, we had all that kind of stuff. The uncle and our uncles will, will choke us up if we doing bad in school right. and all that kind of stuff. Right. That kind of stuff really doesn't happen no more. Right. You know what I'm saying? So we have to, as grown men, have to extend that same courtesy to our kids and say, listen, everything always isn't going to be you know, perfect, perfect or whatever. Yeah. You yeah. might get divorced. You might go right. through whatever you got to. But this is how you do after that. Yes. Right. That's how you, you make it to, right. This is how you make it right. This yes. is the example that you set for your right. kids. Right. That's what I do, man. Uh-huh. I, I'm, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not mad. I'm mad at myself. I fucked up. Right. I cheated. I did what I wasn't supposed to do. Right. You understand what I'm saying? Right. So, Sunny, so, Sunny. so, so, so. At the end of the day. It ain't my. It, 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 it ain't. It ain't. I, I'm not. I shouldn't be mad at him for uh, uh, scooping up a good woman that you was too dumb to know that you had. Right. That's my fault. All right. Uh, accept that man. Accept that dude. You know what I'm saying, yo, man. Boy, it was one time. I asked him. I asked him to go on the boat. He was like, I ain't going on the boat with that nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what the fuck that though? You know? I was like, yo, I'm trying to buy that hey, nigga. Hey, he's not wrong. He's not wrong, he's not wrong for that. He's not wrong for that. <laughs> he's he, he like, I'll take that I'm chance. I'm trying to buy that nigga. But, yo, know, that's, that's, that's what it was. But that's, that's me. That's a good thing about everything. Yeah. Right. That's me, man. That's the, you know, I mean, I, I've i always tried to extend that holler branch, man. Why well, you gotta be on a boat, though? Yeah. Right, yeah. Because I love boats, bro. Yeah. I love boats. Yeah.
But that sounds a little mafia Yeah, yeah. Come, come meet me come in a boat. boat. We're we're a, go. We're going to the lake. Let's go. That's some mafia shit. Yeah, that's some mafia shit right here. Besides that, is there anything you ever regret in your career? Never taking control of it from the beginning. Mm. That's it. Like, meaning, you wish you would have managed yourself from the beginning? Absolutely. But how can you regret that? You wouldn't yeah. know. You were nah, young, yeah. you were early. Well, you say, what I regret. Oh, okay. Right. Say, what I regret. Like, like what I, as where I am now, like, but, damn. Well, if I knew then what I If you knew. Now, yeah, I feel like I didn't know. I didn't regret know. mostly is when it's something that you could have actually done. But in that in that time period, I didn't know you wouldn't have known I, any different. Yeah, I agree yeah, with yeah. you. Depend on that. But, yeah, but you regretting. Just, you would have messed up. You would have messed up. You might have been mad at your, your own self as a manager back then. It didn't. No, yeah. you, you, no. You might have cut you him off. Regret, you wouldn't regret it being your own manager. <laughs> they still can manipulate you. Right, yeah. right, right. Because you got to learn Facts. to go through it. I, I keep saying, I keep saying, um, with age coming wisdom. Yeah, after that. With age and I love wisdom. that. So, yeah, 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 so you had to, like, you know, you know what I, uh, like, I go to the bathroom. I, I, I go to the bathroom. Of course, of course, of course. I was about, about to leave both of y'all right now. Of course, of course. I now feel bad. Of course, of course, of course. Go ahead, go ahead. Maybe y'all know Drink Champs wants to give flowers while people are here to receive them. Giving flowers and celebrating our legends while they can still smell them. We have partnered with What the Flower to create this movement where everyone can give flowers to the legends in their lives. You can now order a custom flower box for the someone you want to show appreciation to by visiting www.wtflower.com and place your orders now. I love the baby right there, man. I appreciate it. You know, this means more than any award that you can get on some real shit because it means that you're appreciated by your peers, you're appreciated by the people that you do it for. And I accept my flowers with love. Yeah. Yeah. I've had a 25-year career. Favorite part of my career, besides being a podcaster right now, mm -hmm. is me in 1998. What is your favorite part of your career? Like, if it was one year, you could boil it down to. Or, or, or just whatever you want to say. I got you. Um, I think it was probably the second album, um, second CD, because, you know, um, uh, uh, they always think you can't do it twice. Mm. Sophomore Jinx. It's sophomore Jinx, right? So... And I was scared, bro. I was very scared because when you coming out with a song like Pony mm -hmm. and and all and I'll do anything, I'm sorry, which was written by um Missy. Mm -hmm. Um and all that, it that took me to a plateau. I was like two point five, I think it was, sales or whatever. So that's a very, very <laughs> hard um uh uh situation to mimic again on the second time. So um, I was very happy when So Anxious came out. Mm. I was very happy because I was like, that's it right there. Because I did um, What's So Different. Uh, and that was the leading single off 100% Genuine. And so uh, Sony and all them was trying to cross me over and all that. And I was like, I don't want to lose my bass. I even knew that then. You know, when he was asking me like, um, did you know this And did you know that I've always I don't even know What it is Like I, I always saw it mm -hmm. And I was like Y'all gonna mess me up Y'all gonna mess me up And so um, When So Anxious came out I was like that's that was what my moment was. I was like, even even over pony actually, because you don't even know what that is. Right. You're just living in the moment. Right. But after you experience all that stuff uh, generated by the uh, uh, the success of those uh, moments, um, you then know if you pay attention. He's like, okay, now I gotta. I gotta, I, I gotta make sure I do this again. So when so, uh, so anxious came out, that was one of those moments. Right, man. Yeah. Yep. Man, this this has been such a fucking beautiful fucking interview, man. I ain't gonna lie. We, we've been waiting for this for six years. We've been stalking yeah, your ass. Hey, man, stop it, man. Stop. Yeah, we've, been, we've been talking about it for a minute. Uh, 
Because we really Sincerely You know This is what Our show is about Our show is uh, I can't stand Thank God for y'all bro I can't stand when people Like you know There's no genre in music That has more than 10 years And they have a word Washed up for them Oh They they call them season Like Rolling Stones All these motherfuckers Still touring for 15,000 years Exactly It's it's, it's some niggas That come out there And just die Right (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> and they still support their ass. That was that and they still support their ass. Yo, you know what I'm saying? Like, come on. So this is the reason why. They like, come out and just die. You know what I mean? Like, ah. they come out and just die. They come out and just And other genres of music, and we shit on our own. You know what I mean? Thank you, this, dog. And I Thank hate you. that. I hate Thank that. You, you know, you. You, you, you know what's so. I hate that. I hate dog. that, man. I really. I hate that. I really love to see. When I see you guys on tour, I love to see it. I really like. Um, I just got a recent a chance to see Nas ah, Wu Tang Clan man, Paris, perform right? in Paris. Ooh, Paris man! And I got lightly offered to get on stage, and I was just like, Nah, let y'all do want that. To, I yeah. wanted to fan yeah, out, yeah, and I yeah. and I did, and I did. I know this footage of me like this. Yeah, <laughs> and I, 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 do the I, same, I don't mind. I, do I the don't same mind. Thing. I want to give it up to my people, and I want my people to understand that. And I went backstage, yeah. Tang, drink I all they you, liquor. I then I went to, you know, of course, I was with Nas. Nas was the yeah. person. Yeah. Yeah, of course, we from both from Queens, from um same damn near same um place. So, but I just I just loved it. To, to 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 see the 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 support right, right right and I just want us to get like you said it earlier like I think that that's what we have to do support Please. each other like for real Please, like bro. and um this is this is definitely one of the reasons because you're a legend man thank you you're bro. An icon thank you bro you're a king uh, and you're a good brother thank you king and. You know, you inspire so many people. No, I try. I try. No, you do. You inspire so many constantly, people. Constantly, constant basis. You make babies, and you make other people <laughs> make babies. And you make. So when you when you see Nick Cannon, oh, he ready. Hold on, hold on. You see, I'm gonna do what you. Uh, yeah. When you when you, when you see everybody talking about how many right babies Nick Cannon had, mm-hmm. what did you think about that? <laughs> I told you not to do it. That's oil. Yeah. Damn. And, uh, that's good. and feet and toes. No, no more. <laughs> yeah. No more. Yeah. But, go, uh, but when yeah. I see that, man. Like, oh. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you can go take his shot. You gotta take my shot. Okay. 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 Are, All right. Salute. Oh, oh, no. Salute. Yeah, you just mixed that. You that was mixed two Yeah, you just mixed two different liquors. Oh, liquor. Fuck it. Let's go for it. Let's see. You the first person to drink chance to do that. Oh. Yo, yo, yo. My brother so, gonna have to pick me up. Yeah, so, yeah, it's okay. Yeah, he there, he right so, there. So, um, when you see like you know, <laughs> Nick Cannon <laughs> with all, <laughs> and then you like nigga, ah, because because they said just now recently that he has ten, and after ten he doesn't have to pay child support. Did you know that? Is that a real thing? No. Is that real? Is that a real thing? That's, 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 that shit is on the blogs. Wait, who's saying that? It's on, it's everywhere. Oh, what? Yeah. Wait, you telling me he made he made an investment in his child support? Stop. Yeah. You don't knock it off. You don't knock it off. Stop it off. Wait, I, I want more. <laughs> Yo, it's, all over. Like, get it's all over the blog. You said 10, you don't have to file taxes. Some oh, shit. No. <laughs> Nobody go by what he's saying right now. No, it's on the blogs though. It's not it's not him. It's not Paul's story. He said taxes. Oh. I don't know about taxes. Oh. Child support. Oh. No, 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 no. I don't know about taxes. I gotta do nah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, listen. Nobody listen to this because I yes, can't, no. can't imagine <laughs> no, we, the number of kids where you don't have to pay for the kids anymore. No, no I don't. I don't imagine that neither. But, but the story has been reported. <laughs> the story has been reported, and you got nine, right? You, oh, you like? Hey. He, he's about to hey. say. Well, now that you mention no, it, no, well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo, his manager oh, said, oh, oh, "Well, he got oh, ten. Oh, hold on. Oh, all my kids are grown. All my kids are grown. <laughs> All right, cool. I got, I got, you I see got, Robert De Niro out here. Six grandkids. Well, so Robert De Niro got new one. Robert De Niro out here. He got something pregnant. What? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Robert De Niro got. He got one on the way. Well, oh, I got two yeah. little ones. I'm still in the trenches. Yeah. Oh. And he's 79. Yeah. What's funny is I actually want more. That's hard. Yeah, I mean, you got nine, right? I want. More. You would be the one to say you want more. <laughs> Get two more. You more. Dominican? You must be Dominican. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> All my Dominican friends advocate for mad kids. <laughs> <laughs> Big family. <laughs> so let, let's let's just count in the music business, people who got over. What is it? oh, it's like it's seven kids? Records. How okay. many? Dmx. Yeah. Old dirty bastard. Yeah. Genuine. Yeah. <laughs> Nick Cannon. Nick Nick yeah. Nick Cannon. Yeah, you up there. What? How many you got? How many you got? You got like eight. Jesus Whoa, Christmas. Whoa, I didn't know that. Oh, I, didn't I didn't know that. that. I, I, I thought it was only a few. Oh, well, it still is a few of us. Uh, you know, you, big you, up you, NBA you young boy. Because yeah. you in those numbers. No, I'm, I'm, I'm wait, six. Wait, 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 yeah, you said about. No. no, you got more. You above. got more than seven. Said, above. Above seven. Yeah, but um, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Y'all been outside, man. Oh my god! Yo, Jay, I, I can't thank you enough, my brother. You, I really, 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 really enjoyed this. Thank I, you. I, I, I really. Um, hold on. Let's end it with a shot. We gotta end it with a shot. Oh, you want one for this, right? No, no, no. no. I've been telling them to stop. Don't know. Yeah, don't know. No. Everybody be trying to be nice to EFN, like mm. yeah, and then they hit it and be like, yeah. <laughs> Cheers. Nah, but I really. Sincerely wanted to give you your flowers face to face, man to man. What you have been done and been doing. Ten kids. NBA got ten kids. Jesus. What? How, how old is he? <laughs> He's what? He, he can't be twenty one with ten kids. No. He, I, then he been outside. Then he got. He, oh. see, he's been outside. He, he got all y'all beat. Then <laughs> if he. Whoa. If, it, it is. Man, this makes a noise for NBA. Whoa. God bless those kids. Man. God, God bless. Them. God bless. Them. God bless. outside. I was outside. I was. I was. outside. I that nigga said foot calling. I respect that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that. I don't know. I don't know. Listen, but listen. <laughs> listen, my brother. Zero in. Yo, listen, Let's you go. are truly a legend. Thank you, King. An icon. You are truly what young artists need to, to see because young artists are making disposable music. Mm. Mm. And you have made lifetime music. Thank you me. have made global music. Thank you. You have made music that every single race, color, creed mm. can relate to. Thank you. And it's standing the test of time. It's legacy still music. there. Yeah. Thank you. And like, that's why... Like, you know, I did Love and Hip Hop and I did uh, yep, I said, uh, yeah. Maris Boot Camp. And I always wanted to tell people, like, sometimes I just wanted to explore. And it's like, I know that's the same thing about you. You like, you didn't do a uh, reality show or theater because right. you needed it. You did it because you was, you was exercising. Yeah. And I, I relate to that. Yeah. But I relate to that from you. Yes, sir. Because I, I, I knew you ain't needed it. Yeah, yeah. And I said, when you did it, I said, fuck it, let me, I like loving hip hop. Let me fuck with this shit. And yeah, I did it. I did one season. I'm up out of there. Ah. I'm not maybe I'm not coming back so like, you know what I mean <laughs> but I love them but I had a hard yeah, a good love, time I love, it's I, love but I just I, you know I'm I chill I love Maris Boot Camp I'm a supporter I love Maris Boot Camp but I probably won't do it again yeah. but it's okay because you gotta have that experience yeah and um I love that about you I kind of yes sir bit, uh, follows you when, um, um, and what I'm trying to tell you is you deserve these flowers thank you you Ken. deserve everything you do yeah at any time at any time you wanna come back if absolutely. you want to, if you want to promote your new S. Caroline, yeah, absolutely, all you. day, straight, we got you. straight we in the cone. Anything <laughs> you come, anything come here. You want to promote your Beijing line? We in, we in, we don't mind genuine. We don't mind, we don't mind genuine. genuine. <laughs> you come anytime you want. You come in front of us. That's this is your house, okay? You need to know that. And then we're going to come to your podcast. We heard you got a podcast before we get up out of here. You okay. want to talk about your podcast? We heard you got a podcast. Nah, I'm, well, I'm, I'm still thinking about it, but okay. nah, uh, yeah, I'm not disciplined like that. Okay, you're not disciplined? You're not ready. Yeah, yeah. All, right. You're good. You're good. All right, cool. Just in case if you need us, we will be there for you. We're going to take a picture and some videos.